my test. Hello, hello, hello. Thank you guys for coming. This is Millie Parfait number two from the second timeline. How are you guys? How are you guys doing today? Good. Hello. Tadaima. Bing bong. Kong kong kong. So I got some milk tea today. So. Uh, I could have a little bit more energy. This is my first time playing this game, by the way. Uh, are you guys supposed to backseat on this one? I don't know. Also, does it have music? Do I do I need to have music on this one? Zero, thank you for the super! Good evening, Millie. Have fun and good luck. Thank you, I will! Okay, depends. Alright. Please adjust, the, please adjust the slider until the computer is barely visible. Barely visible? What is barely visible? Like this? Oh my god, million number two, Bing she's just bong. like me, for real, for real. <laughs> for real, for real. Oh, no BGM? Can you guys... Can you, you can hear this one? No copyright music? Okay. Oh my god, the ping pong's so loud. Uh, barely visible is something you could see, right? Just a slider, barely visible. Like this? Like that? Hi, Millie. Thanks for playing my number one game ever. Question number one, though. Is this a cult? Where is Millie number one? Millie number one is... Gone, I think. She disappeared. <laughs> Bing bong! Uh, alongside uh, the timeline number one. She sacrificed herself so I could live. <laughs> Bing bong! I miss Millie number one, but you're a good replacement. <laughs> Thank you, no fun. You're welcome. I will do my best to make sure that uh, Millie's Millie number one's legacy is still the same. <laughs> ah, okay. Also, thank you so much for joining the membership. Welcome, welcome. I still haven't fixed the the settings yet. Enter the current time. Oh, okay. Ten oh seven. Ten oh seven p.m. Perfect. But, um, hopefully... Hopefully this will... I'm in full screen right now. Is there a way to, like, change this? Accessibility settings can be accessed from the main menu. Okay. But how did you know? <laughs> how did you know I wanted to change the settings? Pretty cool. Alright, let's see. Video mode, full screen, borderless. I'm gonna change that. What is the most standard one? Um, 180 by 1400. Kind coffee! Thank you! What's going on? Amelia number two? Um, yes. Oh, wait. And it's so small now. Uh, we're not gonna have borderless. Uh, full screen window. Up. Oh, that's so small. Bing bong! Oh. Here's one. 1280 by 140, right? Oh, buddy. 1080 by 1920? Okay. Professional streamer, by the way. <laughs> oh, good. It won't work. Why is that? 16 by 9? Okay. 16 by 9? Ah. 16 by... This one. No, 4 by... Ah! Hmm. It's too big for me, though. There you go. That way I can see you, chat. Scuff? I know, right? Sorry, guys. Give me one sec. Uh, so weird. Why is this? Oh, there you go. Nice. Oh. Oh no, you guys saw my house again. My void. <laughs> there you go. I think, I think this should work. I'm gonna move myself here at the side. Both well, million one and two are professional streamers. What are the odds? True. I'm gonna move myself here. How big is this game? Should I, should I be in the middle? Ping pong. I'll, I'll stay myself. Ping pong. Thank you. Are we really on million number two? Yeah. She number one's gone. What do you mean? You know what they say. 
you gotta enjoy the good things in life you until it's gone he's gone forever i'm going to need that report done in the next hour also you'll be on paid overtime what does it mean i'm confused anyway we're gonna play this game apparently it's a lot of fun i uh, i tried myself not to get spoiled by a lot of people because a lot of like niji sanji livers played this game so i'll be looking forward i'll oh i'm looking forward to playing this game. should we start Okay, let's start. Um, how's the volume, by the way? This going is the story oh, ah! of a man named Stanley. Volume Stanley good? Stanley worked for a company in a big building where he was employee number 427. Employee number 427's job was simple. He sat at his desk in room 427 and he pushed buttons on a keyboard. Oh, sounds Orders like a good came job. To him through a monitor on his desk. How about now? Him what buttons to push, how long to push them, and in what order. This is what employee 427 did every day of every month of every year. Hmm. And although others might have considered it soul rending, Stanley relished every moment that the orders came. A little in, lower? As though he had been made exactly for this job. No? Stanley was happy. And then one day, something very peculiar happened. Good? Okay. Something that would forever change Stanley. Something he would never quite forget. He had been at his desk for nearly an hour when he realized that not one single order had arrived on the monitor for him to follow. Whoa. No one had showed up to give him instructions, call a meeting, or even say hi. Where's never everyone? in all his years at the company had this happened. This complete isolation. Whoa. Something was very clearly wrong. This Shot, dystopia? Frozen solid, Stanley found himself unable to move for the longest time. But as he came to his wits ah. and regained his senses, he got up from his desk and stepped out of his office. What is that? What if I don't want to stand up in the desk? Okay, we'll go up. What the? What's the commands here? WASD? I can move now? Okay! WASD? How do you move? How do you move again? Oh, ah, 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 ah. Hello? Hello? Oh my god, hold on. Motion blur. How do I check my motion blur? Forward, wasted, jump space. I am using Wasit. Camera sensitivity? Oh, I hear him. It's a narrator, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Windowed. Hold on. This resolution is still off for me. Okay. Is this good? It's good for my end, but in your end, it's not good. Oh, let me fix this real quick. Sheesh. Professional streamer, by the way. <laughs> uh, stop, make, stop being full screen! Please! I don't want... I don't want it full screen, please. Okay. How do I... How... Oh. Ah. Okay. I guess that works, right? I can't, I can't see the chat. <laughs> move. Chat, move here. Ding dong. 1920 by 1080? This one. Ah! Okay, let's keep that resolution. Nice. It didn't even change in your end. Oh. What the? Oh, hold on. I think that's good enough to see, right? Okay. Like that. It changed? Did it? It's good for us. Okay. Come on. Okay. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. It's all good. All is good. Alright, let's go. I hate Mondays. I also hate Mondays. Actually... Mondays are not bad. 
But he could have scuffed. Nothing. He didn't miss anything. Jump. Can I jump? Achievement unlocked. You can't jump. Wait! But that doesn't make sense. The control says jump on space. Oh. <laughs> Alright. I see how it is. All of his co-workers oh. were gone. Oh what could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Mm. No matter how hard Stanley looked, he couldn't find a trace of his... Stanley went around touching every little <laughs> thing in the office, but it didn't make a single difference. <laughs> nor did it advance the story in any way. How did you know to keep touching? It's just... It's just a gamer thing, you know? Like, whenever you... Whenever you, you start again, you try to look and interact with objects you need to do. That's just how it is, the reader son. <laughs> oh my god, you know what this reminds me of? Um, reminds me of the super giant games. Is it based off this one? Bastion? Yeah, yeah, Bastion. Love Bastion. Oh, whoa. See, I told you it could turn, turn things off. Ah. I could touch everything. But everything looks like a keypad. It's like an ASMR. Where is everyone? It looks like we. we everyone. Did. Was there a zombie apocalypse? Username Maxis? I can't see. I, uh, 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 I can't. I can't read. Is that something you poured in? 421, where's 420? Oh. Yeah, it seems like we're... Um, we missed something. Oh, something bad happened. And we didn't get the memo. Anyone? Anyone here, please? Anyone? When oh. Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Door in his left? This was not the correct way to oh. the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, oh, oh, just this to is left. admire it. Uh, sorry, I didn't know it was... Oh, I don't know the difference between left and right. <laughs> Empty! Empty! 450? Where is everyone? Oh! Ah, yes, truly a room worth admiring. It had really been worth the detour after all, just yeah. to spend a few moments here in this immaculate, beautifully constructed room. Stanley simply stood here, drinking it all in. Oh, do we, are we supposed to follow the direction? Yes, this is Resident Evil and your Barra Chris Redfield is coming to save you, really? I hope you enjoy yes. it. You see what happened? Really, really worth it being here in the room. A room so utterly captivating that even though all your co-workers have mysteriously vanished, here you sit looking at these chairs and some paintings. Yeah, I like it. Really worth it. Yeah, I like it actually. Now that you say, now that you think about it, maybe I should actually look at, this at the point, painting. At this point, Stanley's obsession with this room bordered on creepy and reflected poorly on his overall personality. <laughs> it's possible that this is why everyone <laughs> left. Around waiting for more dialogue. <laughs> but when a long time had passed and there was no more, he decided that the game was trying to send him a message. Whoa, 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 Fort Wall? You're making me want to stay here, Mr. Narrator. You know, humans, when they told to tell things, when they instructed to tell things, a part of them doesn't want to do it, you know? So I'm gonna wait here so you could give me more dialogue. Just because you said so. Come on. Come on. Give us more dialogue. I'm gonna stare at this. Oh, I could, I could, I could stand up on the chair. Oh, it's pretty cool. I like this. What? What plant is this? You know, I always wanted to have like a plant, like a big plant. I got myself some, um, some occulents. Occulents? I got myself some plants. 
Um, it's an air plant because um, I, I really want a plant, but I don't really want to take care of it. An orchid? Is that a... Is orchid, like, really good to take care of? I don't know. Succulent? Yeah, yeah, succulent. What is oculent? <laughs> yeah, I got myself some, su um, some, some succulent. And I got myself an air plant. And um, I got this recently, like last week. But the, the plant is starting to go brown. Is there any like plant lover out there? I really need some help. I think my plant is dying. Orchids are easy to take care of. I, I remember Anna having an orchid and it died. So I don't know. Should we keep going? I don't want to keep going. What if he has more stuff to say? No. No, I'll stay. We'll stay here. Coconut tree? Am I watering it? You're not supposed to water succulents, right? Hmm... That's all of it? Really? Okay. Let's go. Okay, let's keep going. But at last, he'd had enough of the amazing room. Mm -hmm. And took the first open door on his left to get back to business. Left? This is left. Oh, wait, that's right. What's left again? Hmm. Hmm. Bing bong. Shiny. Do I want to become an artist? Do I want to follow this pathway? All my life, I've been following my parents' wishes for me. And I follow it. I... Hmm. I can't decide. <laughs> Why are you giving me options? <laughs> Alright. We are going straight. This is love. We could Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible <laughs> he wasn't fired years ago. Ah, <laughs> uh, where are we anyway? And why do you keep closing the door? Weird. Is there any puzzle here? Because uh, melee number two is not good at puzzles as well. Da -da 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 -da. Warning, do not jump from the cargo. Left motion it will cause that penalty for cargo. What? But in his eagerness to prove that he is in control of the story and no one gets to tell him what to do, <laughs> Stanley leapt from the platform and plunged <laughs> to his death. Good job, Stanley. Everyone thinks you are very powerful. <laughs> ah! Death counter one. Oh. I got easy kind? Oh, shoot. <laughs> All of his co-workers were gone. What could it Death mean? Death count number one. Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps right. he had simply missed a memo. Okay. Okay, we're gonna follow him this time. We're gonna follow him this time. This one is left. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Yeah, I followed you this time, see? I'm a respectful player. Yet, there was not a single person here either. Feeling oh. a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up mm. to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. Meeting room for XX group. Monday, weekly targets, admin, mark, and days. Group? Group? What was the number again? 427. Parking floors meeting. What to do about 432? Don't tell 432 about the meeting. Oh, someone doesn't like 432, huh? Office party. Do not alter without consulting the whiteboard manager. I will alter it. Let's see. Um, push for funding for new coffee machine. No. Ooh, charts. Hire someone to synergize papers. 
Papers are too synergized. Holy shit, that is some Ghost Adventures freaky shit right there. Um... Uh... Unfinished agenda retreat? Oh my god, that is so scary. Holy... Solving interpersonal conflict? Wow, oh, doesn't this look like a old PowerPoint presentation to you? Oh, oh my god. What are your dreams for the future? Mitosis. <laughs> a boat. Less air. Spring break. Clear metamorphosis. Tip for not getting fired. Talk less. Do unbelievably amazing work all the time, every day, with no exception, promotion, or recognition. Don't get fired. Wow, very, very motivational. How to solve a dispute with a coworker? Let's ball it up inside you. Take it out passive aggressive on other coworkers. Resent coworkers for not supporting you more. <laughs> oh my god! Using slides to assure employees that everything is okay. <laughs> Oh, I love that. How do everyone is unique. You most of all. Thank you. Thanks, uh, money, money, more money. Things to buy with money. Char. Oh, I love charts. Charts, charts with slides. Oh my god, this game is for me. I love charts. Which is charts, same slide, depict the same information. Charts. Oh my god. Oh my god, there's more charts! No. <laughs> the boss appreciation minute. Worksheet circle the top 20 things you love about most of your boss. Yeah, okay. Alright, my fellow chat. Since you guys are a lot here, write one thing you like about me. And you can't say. W one word, okay? You have to say different things. Come on. Come on, hit hit me with it. Fuck is it? Who said armpits? <laughs> Everything? Ah! You guys! You guys are so cute! Facts. For real, for real. Stripes, the stock market is somewhere here. Profits, profits, profits. Profits, 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 profits. Okay. Synergize score value expenditures. This looks like a lot of big words, but doesn't make sense. Quarterly pie chart profits. I love your beautiful eyes. Oh, thank you guys. Wholesome? Talking about Millie one or two. Room closet? I love rooms. Stanley stepped into the broom closet, but there was nothing here, so he turned around and got back on track. But there's a broom here. You know, back in the days, I used to use my broom. There I was nothing broom. here. No choice to make, no path to follow, just an empty broom closet. No reason to still be here. No, I was talking about my broom adventures. But back then, when I was a, a little witch, I used to have like. It was baffling that Stanley was still Are just sitting in the broom closet. I was telling he wasn't the story. Even doing anything. At least, if there was something to interact with, he'd be justified in some way. As it is, he's literally just standing there doing sweet FA. What is FA? Broom closet ending. There's a. There's an ending here. Anyway, so when I was like, uh. Are you? Are you really still in the broom closet? Are you gonna standing interrupt me every nothing? single time I talk Why? to my chat? Please offer me some explanation here. I'm I'm genuinely confused. I, I am talking to my chat right now about a broom. Like, can you calm down, please? <laughs> Thank you. You do realize there's no choice or anything in here, right? If I'd said Stanley walked past the broom closet, at least you would have had a reason for exploring it to find out. But it didn't even occur to me because literally this closet is of absolutely no significance to the story whatsoever. Well, it... I never would have thought to mention it. But I'm streaming though. That doesn't make sense. I I'm trying to explain my chat and the story of me when I was a kid in a broom. Maybe to you this is somehow its own <laughs> branching path. Maybe when you go talk about this with your friend, you'll say, Oh, did you get the broom closet ending? The broom closet ending was my favorite. My favorite. I hope your friends find this concerning. Um, no, hold on. Let me remove the bot. 
Stanley was fat and ugly and really, really stupid. He probably only got the job because of a family connection. That's how stupid he is. That all with drug money. Excuse also, Stanley is addicted to drugs and hookers. <gasps> um, narrator son. Well, was... I've come to a very definite conclusion about what's I'm... going on right now. I was trying You're to remove dead. a bot. You got to this broom closet, explored it a bit, and were just about to leave because there's nothing here. I was trying to do a zazu with my chair. Some sort shut down your central nervous system, no. and you collapsed on the. I'm keyboard. not dead. Well, in a situation like this. The responsible thing is to alert someone nearby so as to ensure that your body is taken care of before it begins to decompose. What? I'm so confused. Hello? Anyone who happens to be nearby, the person at this computer is dead. <laughs> they have fallen prey to any number of your countless human physiological vulnerabilities. It's indicative of the long-term sustainability <laughs> of your species. I love Please this narrator. He's so funny. from the area and instruct another human to take their place, making sure they understand basic first-person video game mechanics and filling them in on the history of narrative tropes in video <laughs> gaming, so that the irony and insightful commentary of this game is not lost on them. Oh, I love this game so right. much! When you've done that, just step out into the hallway. Okay. Sorry, narrator. I was just trying to say when I was a kid, I was fun. I was very fond of brooms, you know, I used to like... Even in magic school, I used to um, try to ride a broom, but... Whenever I touch a broom, it always explodes. So... I wasn't, uh, I wasn't able to touch a broom after that. I think I put too much power, attack power, when I, so whenever I touch a broom, it's just like... Bajoom! Oh, Millie, I didn't know you were dead. Oh, hi, I'm, I'm Millie too, nice to meet you. Everything I touch, just the broom specifically. Millie Two is dead. No, it's not dead. Is that it? I think I think that's it. All right, let's get out of here. Ah, second player. It's good to have you on board. Hmm. I guarantee you can't do any worse than the person who came before you too. <laughs> Unbelievable. I'm at the mercy of an entire species of invalids. Perhaps there's a monkey nearby. You can Wait, you didn't close the door. A fish, fungus. Look. You can hammer out the details. I'm not particularly picky. I'll just be waiting for when you're ready to pick up the story again. No, 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 no. The thing is, the thing is, whenever you, the later son, you gotta, you gotta reason out with me on this one, okay? Whenever I pick something, you always close the door. But for some unknown reason, you did not close this one particularly, and so I went back in. Ah! Ah! I could close it. Ah! I thought I could gaslight you into believing that I'm actually... You're the one who's making the choices instead of me. Okay, let's continue. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Boss's office? I thought we are exiting... Um, up or down? Huh, let's go up. Nah, let's go down. Let's... Up. Up, down. Let's go down. Whoa! Um, this does not look good. What? Any note here? Is this like a horror movie? There's a door here. Hmm. Okay, let's keep going. Oh, oh, car. But Stanley just couldn't do yeah, it. Yeah, sorry, narrator. He considered the possibility of facing his boss. Admitting he had left his post during work hours, he uh -huh. might be fired for that. And in such a competitive economy, why had he taken that risk? All because he believed everyone had vanished. Yeah, this was the his first thing I had to do, right? Was crazy. And then something occurred to Stanley. Yeah. Maybe he thought to himself, maybe I am crazy. All of my co-workers blinking mysteriously out of existence in a single moment for no reason at all. Uh -huh. None of it made any logical sense. Yeah, exactly. And as Stanley pondered this, he began to make other strange observations. Like what? For example, why couldn't he see <gasps> his feet when he looked down? You're right! Why did doors close automatically behind him wherever he went? I didn't even notice and about that! for that, that. Matter, these rooms were starting to look pretty familiar. Were they oh. simply repeating? Oh, No, that... Stanley said to himself, this is all too strange. This can't be real. 
and at last he came to the conclusion that had been on the tip of his tongue. I'm in a he video just game! hadn't found the words for it. I'm in a video I'm game! dreaming! No! He yelled. This is all a dream. Oh, what a relief Stanley felt to have finally found an answer, an explanation. His co-workers weren't actually gone. He wasn't going to lose his is job. Is he gaslighting he me thinking that I'm crazy? And he thought to himself, I suppose I'll wake up soon. I'll have to go back to my boring real-life job pushing buttons. I may as well enjoy this while I'm still lucid. So, well, why is the music he imagined changing, himself flying and began to gently float above the ground. Whoa! Then he imagined Whoa! himself what? soaring through space on a magical star Actually? field. And it too appeared. It was so much fun. And what? Stanley marveled that he had still not woken up. How was he remaining so oh, lucid? Shoot. And then perhaps the strangest question of them all entered Stanley's head. One he was amazed he hadn't asked himself this sooner. Is so, this is like a horror movie. Why is there a voice in my head yeah. dictating everything that I'm doing and thinking? Why is my head sound now like the British? the voice was describing itself being considered by Stanley, who found it particularly strange. I'm dreaming about a voice describing me, thinking about how it's describing my thoughts, he thought. And while he thought it all very odd and wondered if this voice spoke to all people in their dreams, I don't the think truth so. was that, of course, this was not a dream. Wait! How could it be? Stop was gaslighting Stanley me! Was simply deceiving himself? Believing that if he's asleep, he doesn't have to take responsibility for himself? Whoa! Stanley Wait, is I'm as looping. awake right now as he's ever been in his life. Oh my god. Now, hearing the voice speak these words was quite a shock to Stanley. Yes, I'm really shocked After right all, now. He knew for certain, beyond a doubt, that this was in fact a dream. Why Did the voice you? not see him float and make the magical stars just a moment ago? Yeah, How wait. else would the voice explain all that? This voice was a part of himself too. Oh, surely, wait. surely, if he could just... He would prove it. He would prove that he was in control. Yes. That this was a dream. So he closed his eyes gently. Huh. And he invited himself to wake up. Wake he me up inside. He felt the weight of the blanket on his skin. The oh, what, what of ending the mattress is this? on his back. The fresh air of a world outside this one. Let me wake up, he thought to himself. Wake me I'm up. I'm through with this dream. Wake me up inside. Over. Let me go back to my job. No, I will not. Let me continue pushing the buttons. Please. Oh. It's all I want. I want my apartment and apartment. my wife and my wife. job. And my job. All I want is my life exactly the way it's always been. Always has been. My life is normal. Normal. I am normal. Everything will be fine. Am I going back to the I beginning again? I am okay. I am not okay. I'm tripping. <gasps> Wait. I did Stanley it. Stanley began screaming. Ah! My name is Stanley. I have a boss. I have an office. I am real. I'm Please, real. just someone tell me I am real. Uh, technically, I'm not real. real. I, I'm an enemy girl. No, 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 I'm an enemy girl. No. Oh. And everything went black. He has the power over me. We have to stop him. This is the story of a woman named Mariella. Mariella woke up on a day like any other. I'm so confused! She rose, got dressed, gathered her belongings, and walked to her place of work. Oh my god! But on this particular day, her walk was interrupted by the body of a man who had stumbled through man. town talking and screaming to himself, and then collapsed dead on the sidewalk. And although she would soon turn to go call for an ambulance, for just a few brief moments, she considered the strange man. He was obviously crazy. Oh this shit! Much she knew. Everyone knows what crazy people look like. And in that moment, she thought to herself how lucky she was to be normal. Dude, this damn is safe. crazy! I am in control of my mind. I know what is real and what isn't. It was comforting to think this. And in a certain way, seeing this man made her feel better. What? But then she remembered the meeting she had scheduled for that day. Um. The very important people whose impressions of her would affect her career. And by extension, the rest of her life. At least call 911 to pick up my dead this. body. So it was only a moment that she stood there, staring down at the body. Call 911! And then she turned and ran. No! Now you're a suspect for murder, Mario. We should have called 911. Oh! 
I'm back again! Isekai number three. You can't stop me! All of his co-workers were gone. You can't stop me! I'm mean? gonna defy Stanley you! Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. You, you killed me two times already! I will defy you in every way I can. When Stanley came I don't to get a it, don't talk to me! Door, this was not the correct way to the meeting room. No, and Stanley knew I'm not gonna well. talk to you! No, no, Perhaps no! Get out of my head! Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Get out of my head! Wow. Oh. Yes, this room. But eager to get back to yeah. business, Stanley took You're the first gonna... open door on his left. No! Wait, this is like the same main... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Stanley was so bad at following directions, yeah, 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 it's incredible yeah, whatever. he wasn't fired years ago. Do not jump from the cargo while the fish in motion. What if I jump, though? Do not jump from the cargo. Okay, can I? If I jump... Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. I can't jump, I realize though. that investing in your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. Yeah, I am the protagonist. There's someone you've been neglecting, Stanley. Someone you've forgotten about. What's wrong? Please, stop trying to make every decision by yourself. You're not the boss of me. You tried to kill me two me. times. I'm asking for her. Who's her? Who's her? Me? This is it, Stanley. Your chance to redeem yourself, to put your work aside, to let her back into your life. She's been waiting. Who's she? My wife? Come on, let me see if I can like, interact in here. Um, who is she? Bold of you to assume that I have anyone important in my life. You can't bait me with that. Alright, let's go here. Okay, door's closed. Elira? Uh. Whoa, this is just a room full of darkness. Huh? Ah! Oh, fudge! That's her, Stanley. Oh my god! You need to be the one to do this. To reach out to her. If you can truly place your faith in another, then pick up the phone. I will not pick up the phone. Nope. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. Is there a way to get out of here? I will not listen to you. You're being a bad narrator. As Stanley picked up the phone, a white light engulfed him, filling him not just with radiance, but with hope. Hope for a life reunited one... Wait. Oh, goodness. Stanley, did you just unplug the phone? Yes. No, that wasn't supposed to be a choice. How did you do that? Because, um... You actually chose incorrectly. Yeah! I didn't even know that was possible. Because Let I don't want to... Check. I want to defy you. Whoa, 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 whoa. ASMR? No, it's definitely here. Clear as day. Stanley picks up the phone. He's taken mm -hmm. to his apartment where nope. he finds his wife. And the two pledge themselves to one another. Oh, I Music have a wife. comes in. Fate to white. Roll credits. Not picking up the phone is actually somehow an incorrect course of action. How is that even possible? None of these decisions were supposed to mean anything. I don't understand. How on earth are you making meaningful choices? Because I don't want to you... listen to you. Wait a second. Did I just see... No, that's not possible. I can't what you believe see it. What? How had what I not noticed it sooner? Then I'm smarter? You're Stanley. You're a real person. <sighs> I can't believe I was so mistaken. This is why you've been able to make correct and incorrect choices. And to think I've been letting you run around in this game for so long. Oh my god. If you've made any more wrong choices, oh you god. might have negated it entirely. It's as though you completely ignored even the most basic safety protocol for real-world decision-making. Or did you not grasp the severity of the situation? Well, I won't have that kind of risk on my watch. I'm going to stop the game for a moment so we can educate you properly on safe decision making in the real world. Please observe this helpful instructional video. I'm so confused. Choice. <laughs> it's the best part of being a real person. But if used incorrectly, it can also be the most dangerous. For example, in this scenario, a hypothetical real person named Rupert has a choice. Uh -huh. He can invent a machine that eliminates food shortages across the world to make life better for all people. Uh -huh. Or he could spend years of hard work forgetting how to read. <laughs> Which choice would you make? 
Remember that unlike here, the real world makes sense, and at no time should you make a choice that does not conform to rational logic. If you find yourself speaking with a person who does not make sense, in all likelihood, that person is not real. Allow the person to finish their thought, then provide an excuse why you cannot continue talking. Turn to a partner and practice saying, my goodness, is it 4.30? I'm supposed to be having a back sack and crack. Back sack and crack? What is that? Practice. Excellent. Oh. Making choices on a regular basis <laughs> is the best part to a healthy decision-making process. <laughs> Most medical professionals recommend making at least eight choices per day. Do you make more than eight? Less? And finally, if you begin to wonder if your choices are actually meaningful I mean, and whether you'll ever make a significant contribution to the world, I don't think just so. remember that in the vast infiniteness of space, your thoughts and problems are materially insignificant. Wow, and the thanks for the existential subside. crisis. At this time, your instructor will guide you in an exercise to test and reinforce the material covered in this video. They're really forcing me to build, like... Okay. Ah. Welcome back. Oh, thank you. You may have noticed that this room has begun to deteriorate as a result of narrative contradiction. Okay. But not to worry. Now that you're properly informed on good decision making, we're going to revisit a choice you made just a few minutes ago and okay. see what the correct thing to do would have been. This way, please. No. I I don't think we should. It says exit here. Oh. Can I ride the... Uh, can I ride this? What do you call these things? Forklifter? That's a good question. Yeah, actually, that's actually a good... Um, that video right there. Kind of makes you think. Your choices are so insignificant to the world that it doesn't really matter in the long run. Damn. Thanks. Forklifts? Forklift? Oh yeah, I don't have a... How many choices do you guys get to do in a day? Can I still pick this up? Ring, 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 ring. No. Do we have to exit? Do I really have to go? I don't want to go. Can I just stay here? Will something happen if I just stay here? Zero? And you make one per day, go back to sleep. Honestly, that is such a mood. I guess the moment you wake up, you kind of like get... You kind of get to pick a choice, right? I'll stay. Will the narrator force me to get out of here? If I stay. We could stay here for two hours. And, um... This should be fun. Right? This is our choice. We could stay here... And we could, um, see if he's gonna force us to get out of here. Surprise Zatsu! Surprise TR Zatsu! Ah. Oh yeah, I don't mind doing a Zatsu. You, I have the power of uh, my mouth. <laughs> For a Zatsu Don. So, everyone... I watched this movie recently called... Everywhere, anything, uh, at the same time? Is that correct? Every, uh, it's a really long title. Everywhere, every, everywhere, everything, all at the same, all at one. That's a really good movie. I would recommend you guys watching. It's a really, really nice movie. Uh, it talks about like multiverses and stuff. Really interesting too. It started really slow. And then, um... And then it, it picks up, and then it has like this really, really nice, um, kind of like, I don't really want to spoil it, but, like different, um, uh, multiverses, right? So every action splits it, uh, every action you make splits it into different universes. So this universe, the main character is kind of like this loser. She's not a loser, but like apparently, quote unquote, from the movie, she picked all the worst decision possible. And so she's the probably the worst. That's why she's good at anything she do. Anything she does is good. You know what that means? You know what I'd say. So yeah, whenever you feel like life sucks, just just imagine yourself that you're the worst person in the universe. And uh, 
once you once you realize that you're the worst person, you 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 could think that you know the the next thing that you do is uh, the next decision, then the next course of action that you will do in the future will be the most positive one. Does that make sense? All negatives turns into positives. Also, he's not replying to me. Oh, also, holy Eva! shit, what happened here? It clipped. Ah, thank you for the super! Uh, Raraka Kuni was the best side story of everything, everywhere, all that one. I... I like the hot dog fingers. Oh my god, why is the bot... Am I in subscriber mode? I'm pretty sure I was in subscriber mode. Stop subscribing to me, bot. I don't need you. Get up, please. Please, hide me here. I may have to ask my secret police. Okay, let's go. Oh, are we going back here again? Oh my god. Let me in! Okay. Huh? Oh! Now that we know your choices are meaningful, we can't have you jumping off the platform and dying. <laughs> Imagine the main character dying senselessly halfway through the storm. Ah, that's that story why. would make no sense. That's why you made it. <laughs> we just need to get you home as soon as possible before the narrative contradiction gets worse. Oh my god. Worse. Unfortunately, it seems this place is not well equipped to deal with reality. Oh my god, he is now. He is now. He is now forcing us to do his bidding. Interesting. 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 He's not giving us any more choices. Mm. I, see, I see. I see what you're trying to do here, narrator. What are you? What are you trying to do? I'm so confused. Oh, the numbers are gone. Are the numbers supposed to be gone? Oh man. Oh man. It's Almost there. You'll take the door on the left, back to the correct ending, the story will have resolution once again, and you'll be home free in the real world. Oh my god. He's not giving me any choice anymore. Yep. Now remember, all you need to do is behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> when Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Hey. Oh. No! Why did you do that? Oh, shoot! Quickly, hurry oh. back in the other direction. Perhaps we're not oh. too late. What is happening? Why is the reality twisting? Uh, uh, narrator Sam? Oh, this is trippy. No, I want to go back. Let me out of here. I want to see. Can I? Can I go in? Can I go out? Oh, let me. Oh my God. Picking the right. You're. He's really forcing me to pick like the way he wanted to find here. Does that does that work? Um, hello. Oh, it's ruined. You. I can't believe after everything we talked about that you. My story! You've destroyed my work! I Why? love chaos. For what? What did you get out of that? What did you think was so special about seeing the game undone? <gasps> left here like so much garbage. It, well, it's worthless now. And what am I supposed to do? Even if there were a way to continue, would it be worth it? To know that my story is now incorrect? How can I go back to that? I'm the Witch of I Calamity. Of course I love chaos. I'll have to live with it forever. Yeah. Reliving its impossibility forever. Oh, I couldn't live that way. Oh. Is it better to shut the game down entirely? To willingly destroy all of my work? I don't know. What's the answer? What do I do? What do I do? What well, do I... Well, you picked the wrong... No, I have to. I have to shut the game do down. Do not shut down I the game, to. please. No. I have to. No, 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 no. 
seen a game rage quit before. Whoa, trippy. I'm here. I'm still here. Here in this pile of rubbish. With you. You who thought you were so clever. Now look where we are. No one told me that I'm My clever. My game is destroyed. Beside this one whole hell of mine. In the world that was mine and you run it into the ground. What, did you think that would be funny? Yeah. You just had to see? Yeah. Didn't I impress upon you how important it was to be like Stanley? Too bad you picked he me as your main character. He knows how to do what I tell him to. He understands that if I say to do something, there's a damn good reason for it. That thought but hadn't even Stanley. occurred to you, had it? That there's a world outside of you? You're a child. Am I a pretty uh -oh. child? <sighs> My story... At least answer that. If you'd just gone through the door on the left, you would have seen it. There was a whole underground facility. Ah! You would have destroyed it and been victorious. It Boy, would have been so much? perfect. I worked so hard on it. I tried so hard to make... Huh. ...behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> When Stanley Somebody came to a either. set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. No. You didn't tell me no. I'm a pretty child. Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry back. <laughs> behave exactly as Stanley would. <laughs> that means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All no. right. <clears throat> When Stanley came nope. to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. No, he can't shoot. Oh, he didn't respond. He didn't respond anymore. He didn't respond anymore. The raiders on. Where are you? Where did no. he? No. Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry back. Behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first. All I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> when Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Left, right, left side, right side. No! Why did no. you do that? Quickly, hurry back. Oh. Behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and you always putting the king. story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. Left All side, right, right <clears> side. <throat> when Stanley I came to a set of two open doors, ba, ba, ba. he entered the door on his left. Three, two, one. No! I was gonna see no one. No! Again. Why, Why did, did you do, do that? that? Quickly, hurry back. Is behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> when Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Okay. We'll do it. We'll do it. Haha. <laughs> One more time, though. Please! Let me just see what the other outside looks like. It's gonna say, No! Why did you no. do that? Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry back. Oh, I was too late! Okay, one more time. Behave exactly as Stanley One more time. Would. I'm pretty that sure I could do it. Responsibly if I go in, go out, run. the story run. first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and no, you'll be fine. No, no, no. All right. <clears throat> I'm gonna. When I'm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna to go a set of okay. two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Okay. Go in. Go in. Get out. Okay, hold on. Go in. Go in. No. Okay. Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry back. Oh, no. Is behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting <laughs> the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. Okay, All fine. Right. You're forcing <clears throat> me to do this. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, 
He entered the door on his left. Entered the door on his left. Okay. I did it, narrator. See? More charts. Yet there was not a single person here either. Uh huh. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. <laughs> I closed the broom closet. <laughs> Coming to a staircase, <laughs> Stanley walked upstairs to his <laughs> boss's office. He locked the door! He locked the staircase down! That's so funny. <laughs> oh my gosh! He is not giving me a choice at all. This is so interesting. He's... This is my first time being here, narrator. Oh, fun stuff. Is this his boss room? This is a not oh, I guess I guess so. So this is stepping inside his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any oh. human life. Shocked, okay. unraveled, Stanley wondered in disbelief who orchestrated this. Yeah, until who? he saw the door with a voice receiver next to it. Huh? Surely behind this door lay all the answers to his questions. And beyond all probability, he knew the passcode. He had seen it on his boss's computer just last week. Johnny, thank you for the super! 115. Was this the code to open the door? Would it still work? There was only one way to find out. Huh? Stanley had been trained never to speak up. But now, he would draw from within himself the courage to face the unknown. He drew a sharp breath and then spoke the code. Narrator, I forgot the code. There wait a minute. What is the what's the code again? Stanley spoke the oh. code. Night Shark 115. Night Shark. He spoke it into the receiver right there on the wall. Where's the wall? This one. Which wall? I'm sorry, is there a problem? You didn't mishear me, did you? Please speak the code into the receiver. Where's the receiver? Otherwise, we can't get on with the story. This is a crucial step. Yeah. Hello? Night, Night Shark 115. Okay, fine. You're not going to do it. But you know what? It's pretty humiliating to bring you this far, only for you to suddenly decide you have better things to do. <laughs> I've asked you for this one single thing for your respect. <laughs> The kind of respect Stanley shows for his choices. He knows what it means to take a story He's seriously. Mouthing. If you didn't want to see what I had to show you, then why did you come here? The you had a choice, you, you know. You could have gone through the door on the right. You could I have did. done whatever the hell you wanted over I there. Did, why did you come this way? Speak. You forced me. Say something to me. Explain yourself, you coward. You. See? I told you. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, <laughs> he the door they kicked me out. He kicked me out! Danny? <laughs> Hello? Are you... Is everything okay? Um... Stanley, please. I... I need you to make a choice. The end? I need you to walk through the door. Are you listening <laughs> to me? Can you hear me? Is everything all right? What? <laughs> Stanley, the this is important. The story needs you. It needs you oh to make a decision. Oh my God! It cannot exist without you. Do you understand me? Let me in. I'm a, I'm enough. That's correct. You can't be wrong here. We can work together. I'll accept what oh you do. I simply need you to take that step forward, please. <laughs> do something. Oh my <laughs> gosh. Oh this no. He's so sad now. now. I need this. Oh. Oh. So, you hear me? Oh no. Are the narrator is so sad. Stanley, are you there? Okay. <laughs> it's okay, I can wait. Oh no! Time to, Time to make sure your choice is correct. Ah, eh? uh, David, thank you for the super. That's all right. Oh, I'll wait for god. you to decide what's the right thing to do. Oh my god, this is so sad! Take as much time as you need. For eternity. The narrator is going to wait there for an eternity until. Until he moves, but we can't move anymore. Okay, narrator son. We've been breaking your rules a lot. And I think it's time for us to follow. 
I, I feel bad after that. I think we should follow what he wanted. He literally... All he wanted was for us... To have this wonderful story. And so, we will give it all to him. his co-workers were gone. We're back, narrator. Mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he Sorry. had simply missed a memo. Sorry, narrator son. We're, we're going to follow what you wanted, okay? Can I close doors? When no. Stanley came to a set of two open doors, yeah. he entered the door on his left. Yep. We're following what you wanted. We're even closing Yet the door. There was not a single person here either. We're even closing the door Feeling for you, narrator Sama. Disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office. Hoping he might find an answer there. Yes. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked yep, upstairs yep, yep, to his boss's office. We're going. See? Oh! This is different, kinda. Executive bathroom. Wait, this is a new option. To be rich, is it a crime? To commit crimes, isn't it rich? What a life would it be? So pick up just one. Extreme bathrooms! Ever wanna feel like you wanna have diarrhea? Wanna have an explosive time? Sign up for explos extreme bathrooms for more explosive content about toilets! Yeah, it's oh, I can't see him. Oh, it's just... Nothing, it's just a bathroom. Okay. Yeah, let me explore a little bit because it oh, God. My first time being here. Well, not really. Oh This is different. This is different, right? I feel G Web Gaming, thank you for the super the sad ending makes me want to hug the narrator and tell him it's going to be okay. I know, I feel so sad. This is new. Hold on, can I check this one? Elevator. Bing bong! We have to follow his narration, right? But I can't stop. I love elevators. This is the executive's office, right? Can we go up or down? Up. Oh! Dun, dun. down. Bing bong. Bang, 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 ba -da -da -bang. Oh, okay. I guess they're just like me, huh? They just like elevators. Understandable. Stepping into his manager's office, ding, 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 Stanley ding, was ding, once ding, again ding, stunned ding, 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 to discover ding, 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 not an ding, 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 indication ding, 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 of any human life. Shocked, <gasps> unraveled, Stanley wondered in disbelief who orchestrated this. What dark secret was being held from him? How dare! What he could not have known was that the keypad behind the boss's desk guarded the terrible truth that his boss had been keeping from him. And so the boss had assigned it an extra secret pin number. Uh -huh. Two, eight. Four, five. But of course, Stanley couldn't possibly have known Close. this. What's up, narrator? What's the pin again? In any of the books? Stanley just sat around twiddling his thumbs. Trying to input anything on the device was useless, since he could never possibly know that the combination was 2845. 
Incredibly, by simply pushing random buttons on the keypad, Stanley happened to input the correct code. Oh my God! Code, my vision is going out. <gasps> Amazing! He stepped Whoa. into the newly opened passageway. What is happening? I'm getting photo. Sh is this? Am I getting on a photo shoot? What is happening? Whoa, 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 what's happening? This elevator is not cool. Loading? Descending deeper into the building, Stanley realized he felt a bit peculiar. It was a stirring of emotion in his chest, as though he felt more free to think for himself, to question the nature of his job. Why did he feel this now, when for years it had never occurred to him? This question would not go unanswered for long. I see nothing ah! Ah! Oh, what is this? Whoops, nope. Uh, never mind. Stanley actually got back into the elevator <laughs> and went back up. Save me. Why did Stanley do that when he knew that it would just lead back to his boss's office? Well, that's a great question. I just can't wait to find out. I don't know either. <laughs> That's how that looks like a place that I played before, you know, in Outlast. Whoa. This is not the boss office, is it not? I don't wanna be here anymore. Narrator! Here we are, Stanley. It's your boss's office. Uh -huh. Exactly the way it was before you got onto the elevator. It's still just exactly what it is. What a decision you've made to come up here and look at the office again. This has fleshed out the plot of the story in new and fascinating ways I could have never anticipated. Thank you. It's that keen eye for storytelling that you have. <laughs> An incisive rapid fire of critical <laughs> plot points, one after the other, weaving a rich tapestry of uncompromising narrative. Wow. <laughs> yeah. I'm bolted to the edge of my seat. Gotta make sure we got everything. You said 888, right? Eight. Eight. That's it. Two four. Two eight four five, right? What's my birthday? Twelve twelve. One, four, three. You. Eight zero zero. Oh. Eight, eight. Two four three four. Yeah, let's do that. Four. Do you know Niji Sanji's not narrator? else we could explore? Well, can we clip here? No. Okay, let's go down. I think I think there's nothing else here anyway. Alright, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Incredible. Now he's getting back into the elevator and going down again. Yeah! Ladies and gentlemen, how does he keep <laughs> coming up with all of this? Because you're so funny! <laughs> Did you think we were going to go forward down the spooky corridor? <laughs> no. It's time once again to go back <laughs> up in the elevator. I can't even begin to grapple with what might be up there. Is it the boss's office again? Or what if it's the boss's office this time? The suspense is killing me. back in oh my god oh my god it's the boss's office <sighs> this absolutely changes everything for me <laughs> give me a time out here for a minute while i process this <laughs> oh <laughs> Okay, 
I'm ready. <laughs> he must I'm prepared to embrace this stunning revelation <laughs> and to move forward with no, no wait. Yeah. No, I need more time to process. Process. Dun, 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 dun. Sorry, narrator son, we made a fool out of you. I hope you're doing great. All right. I have fully come to terms with it. I mm. have made space in my worldview for this astonishing new reality. I'm glad. As before, I turn to your expert eye for gripping narrative, Master Stanley. Eight, 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 eight. Okay, let's go back. This time for real. I promise I'm not gonna press the hop elevator again. I promise. Of course. Going back down in the elevator. How did <gasps> I not anticipate it? I mean, sure, now it's obvious, but you have to understand that 30 <laughs> seconds ago, this kind of thing had never been attempted before. I had no frame of reference to even anticipate it. Oh, That's yeah. just how revelatory Stanley's decision-making <laughs> oh, is. Oh, compliment me more! in a landscape of storytelling that has grown stale and repetitive. I want to do it one more time. He's not going to be upset, right? <laughs> I just thought of something. Hold on, let's stop for a moment. Don't you realize? It's the anticipation, Stanley. Uh -huh. You and I, we have no way of knowing what will be at the top of this elevator. But the suspense, the agony of waiting and anticipating and having to guess, that's the real thrill. Oh, I simply don't want to let that feeling go. Oh, it's so right? precious, so fleeting. Yeah, exactly. Why don't we take this elevator ride nice and slow? Oh no! There we go. Isn't this so much more <laughs> exciting? You know, Stanley, it seems like oh, nowadays no! the only thing that audiences want is to be shocked as loudly and frequently as possible. They want big, explosive moments flung <laughs> right in their faces from the very moment that things get started. But where's the tension? Right. Where's the trust in the audience to build a slow and nuanced appreciation for the story? You're getting the it characters. now! Why aren't we given time to imagine the surprises? Exactly! To have to think and to anticipate and then to marvel at the eventual reveal. Mm -hmm. This is storytelling, Stanley. What you and I are doing right now. This is the most exciting narrative <laughs> to be developed in years. The boss and it's room. really all because of you. I know! You're the one who took this bold step of revisiting the exact same locations over and over. Truly, I mean it. <laughs> this is unique and different. It's not like anything else out there. You see, I want stories that surprise me, Stanley. <laughs> I want to have to think. I want to be engaged and not pandered to. We're being fed such unimaginative <laughs> drivel all the time, and we all know it, which is why we're so starved for content that makes us feel sharp and vital and alive. <laughs> That's why people like you so much, Stanley. Thank you. Because you're not afraid to spit in the face of tradition. Uh -huh. You're a role model, you know? People look up to you. Really? Which is why... Oh, I didn't know when to spring this on you, but... Well, I've gathered a little press conference for you. For so me? that you can talk about your work and your storytelling and your life. Finally, yes, I know someone. you're not much for the public eye, but I thought it would especially mean a lot to the people who have been following you from the beginning. They really look up to you, Stanley. Ah, uh, thank you for doing the membership. Welcome. I don't know if you realize the impact you have on them. Mm. This is the kind of gesture that might leave a tremendous impact on them for the better. Oh, good, we're here. Whoa! I have my own press conference? Okay, the room where we're holding the press conference Whoa! should be just around the corner here somewhere. The world's healthiest human being, all tricks revealed. How we did it, the pyramids. The guy who went to Mars. All eyes on, all eyes on Stanley live on stage. Whoa! I have my own press conference. Damn, you thought you didn't have to, narrator. World peace, baby. Ah, yes. Here it is, just through this door. Stanley Parable Stanley, tonight live on stage. I'm scared. It's very fancy, yeah. 
World's first sentient machine. Uh. Doing great. A conversation with Alexander the Great. This right. stage. Are you ready? Yeah. I've told them you're going to speak a little bit about the nature of surprise in storytelling and what it means to craft a truly unpredictable narrative. Oh, don't seven. worry. You'll do great. Just be yourself and I'm speak nervous. from the heart. I'm, I'm really proud of you, Stanley. Thank you. Okay. It looks like they're ready for you. Go Michael get them. Sorry, Stanley. Dad. Wait, I have a kid? Make a leg champ, your boss. Two boss. No one tells stories the way you do. Go get him, tiger. I love the way you ride the elevator. <laughs> Stanley! My true love for you grows every day. You make me feel alive. Your wife from the apartment... Ending. Apartment ending. Okay, let's go. I'm ready. I'm ready. I always wanted to have a press conference, you know? <gasps> Deep breaths! <gasps> oh. Time for my new debut! Whoa! Oh my god! Hold on! I always wanted to do this. Ow! Ow! Too loud! Ow! 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 Wait! I even did, I didn't even put my avatar there. What? What? I was not famous all, all along. All his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? What? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Oh man! All right, we'll follow you. Uh, promise, we're gonna go. When right Stanley now. came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Oh my god. <laughs> the only time I become famous, I Yet passed there out. there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley right. decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. Can we still go in the room? Oh no. Oh, no, 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 not again. I won't be part of this. I'm not going to encourage you. I'm not going to say anything at all. I'm just going to be patient and wait for you to finish whatever it is you enjoy doing so much in this room. Please take your time. <laughs> okay, I'm done. I promise. I promise. <laughs> I promise, I promise. No more. Okay, I'll stop. <laughs> Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Oh, so funny. I love him. I love the narrator so much. Oh, we've been here before. Oh. Stepping into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human. Stanley was in such a rush to get through the story as quickly as possible, he didn't even have a single minute to just let the narrator talk. That kind of anxiety isn't healthy, so he relaxed for a few moments with some calming New Age music. <laughs> <laughs> and rejuvenated, Stanley calmly walked forward oh into the open Oh my god! Space. I freaking love this! I love this game so much! <sighs> Alright, let's get it. Let's go downstairs. Let's go. <laughs> I love that! I love that so much! Can't help it. I love red buttons. Whoops. Nope. Uh, never mind. Stanley actually got back into the elevator and I want to be a out. famous again. Silly me. Why did Stanley do that when he knew that it would just lead back to his boss's office? Well, that's a great question. I just can't wait to find out. <laughs> Can I be famous again? 
Here we are, Stanley. It's your boss's office. Mm. Exactly the way it was before you got onto the elevator. It's still just exactly what it is. What a decision you've made to come up here and look at the office again. This has fleshed out the plot of the story in new and fascinating ways yep. I could have never anticipated. It's that keen eye for storytelling that you have. Okay, let's An go. incisive rapid fire of critical plot points, one let's after go, the let's other, go, it's fine. weaving a rich tapestry of uncompromising narrative. Wow. <laughs> I'm bolted to the edge of my seat. Yeah, sorry, I just want, I was holding her arm. Incredible. Now he's getting back into the elevator and going ah! down again. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, how does he keep coming up with all of this? Okay, it looks like he's just a loop. Surely this ah! time Stanley will walk forward into the spooky corridor, won't he? Why is it so... Why is there sparks? Okay, I'm gonna listen to you now. Okay, sorry, 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 narrator son. Stanley ah! walked straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Facility. <gasps> Mind Control. It says red escape. Although this passageway had the word escape written on it, the truth was that at the end of this hall, Stanley would meet his violent death. Really? But of course, Stanley thought better of it. Nope, still on board with death. How do I know if I die? Um... Hmm... It says escape on it! I love escape. The door behind him was not shut. Stanley still had every opportunity to turn around and get back on track. This is a long hallway. At this Please. point, Stanley was making a conscious, concerted effort to walk forward uh -huh. and willingly confront his death. I died once already, so... This is nothing. Oh. Can I go back? Oh shit. Oh! Wee! Oh! I lived! Oh sh. Oh, ah. As the machine whirred into motion and Stanley was inched closer and closer oh, to oh, his oh, demise, oh, 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 he reflected ah. that his life had been of no consequence whatsoever. Oh, oh. Stanley ah, ah. can't see the bigger picture. Yeah, I don't actually. He doesn't know the real story, trapped forever in his narrow vision of what this world is. Oh. Perhaps his death was of no great loss, like plucking the eyeballs from a blind man. It's okay, so I'm gonna live again anyway. He willingly accepted this violent end to his brief and yeah! shattered life. Thank ah! you, Stanley. Please, narrator! You could stop this, right? Narrator! Mercy! Ah! I knew it. Farewell, Stanley, cried the narrator, Who as Stanley was led helplessly into the enormous metal jaws. Who are you? In a single visceral instant, Stanley was obliterated as the machine crushed every bone in his body. Who killing are you? Him instantly. Or not. The Stanley Parable. Huh? What happened? I'm so confused. Why did the narrator change? What? And yet it would be just a few minutes before Stanley would restart the game back in his office as alive as ever. Right. What exactly did the narrator think he was going to accomplish? I don't know. When every path you can walk has been created for you long in advance, death becomes meaningless. 
making life the same. Okay. Do you see now? No. Do you see that Stanley was already dead from the moment he hit start? Oh, shoot! <coughs> Stanley's computer. Office layout. Am I in heaven? Am I in heaven? Am I dead? Am I dead? This is the layout, yes. Corridor? Pacing off. Pacing off this opening section is important to get right. The corridor has been moved and altered to make sure the player reaches two doors at the same time. Okay. Filing cabinets. Hey, this is my... Um... Cubicle. The office. Is this spoiler? Da da a oh, credits? Oh da 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 Maintenance room Oh Fun I'm so confused Warzo Is this spoilers? We designed an ending where Stanley would end up in a battlefield fighting aliens. The action game will become sentient in the wage war against the narrator. We realized shortly after starting to build that it was far too jokey and on the nose for the tone of the game. Plus, some people interpreted it as making fun of people who like shooters. Which is not our intention. Oh no, more bots! Bots, stop! Please! Stop! <coughs> Alien base. It is over the top. The lounge. The office. Whoa. Apartment timer? Three, two. Whoa. Option one, two, option. Vent? Two doors to window. Maintenance layout. This is all. Sending lovers. Whoa. Trailers. How do we exit here? The layout of the game? Oh, I see, I see. Uh, uh, how do we start? Game is not pause. Escape menu. How do we get out of the museum? I just wanted to see the narrator's ending. Okay, I, pr I promise I will do it. It's just sometimes you tend to like do things, you know? Narration outtakes. Key. Now look closely, Stanley. See how it's impossible for the player to do anything in this room. Stanley's perfect example of poor level design. Textbook mistake. It's yeah, the kind well, of thing you pick up on intuitively if you had even the most oh, fundamental oh, understanding. They're throwing a surprise party for him for all his buckles. Of course, you being you, you'll possible? probably Whoa. spend the next hour trying to solve it. Here, I'm just going to make this easy on you. Where he was supposed to be in the story. Hmm. Let's see. Stanley walked through the green door. Finally, he pushed the number nine. Stanley pushed the orange. Okay. How do we get out of here? For real though, how do we get out? This is a nice take though. Maybe we should exit over there. Oh, There's an exit somewhere? Go up. Okay. Head to the top. To the right. Okay. Right. There's an exit sign? Okay. Da, 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 da. It's the elevator! Oh, here it is. <laughs> oh, look at these two. How they wish to destroy one another. How they wish to control one another. Uh -huh. How they both wish to be free. Can you see? Can you see how much they need one another? Uh -huh. No, perhaps not. Sometimes these things cannot be seen. 
But oh. listen to me. You can still save the ah! You can stop the program before they both fail. Push escape and press quit. There's no other way to beat <coughs> this game. As long as you game. move forward, you'll be walking someone else's path. Stop now and it'll be your only true choice. Wait, what? Whatever you do, choose it. Don't let time choose for you. Don't let Oh, I actually got squished this time, I think. Oh. Alright. Someone was following Stanley. He was sure of it. If he checked over his shoulder now, he would surely catch them. It was only a matter of time. Whoa. Someone was following different? Huh? Someone is following me? Whoa, 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 whoa. The narrator. Am I am I Stanley number two? In this life? When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, Whoa. he entered the door on his left. That was cr crazy. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Whoa. Fun. This game is really fun. Is this the boss office? No, this way. <laughs> the broom? Okay, I think we all. What? What? Wait! 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 What? We just wanted to go to the closet. Whoa! 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 Why did it went to avoid? Why did it go to avoid? to the void? Wait, wait, I am. I am going. Go all the way back? Go all the way back to my office? Wait, why? Bing bong! The door glitched? Okay, you, I broke it? Okay. Wait, what happened? How did the, how did the game broke? Narrator, where are you? I'm, I'm now leaving. Hmm? Escape, Escape pod 760. It's so dark, I can't see anything. Seven fifty five. Oh my god, this this is so scary. I'm I'm so scared. I'm really I'm really scared. Whoa, whoa, whoa. 760, right? Oh my god. Something about like dark corridors and just like looping. Oh my god, please. 
Narrator, I feel very uncomfortable without you nagging me around. I kind of miss you. Oh. Yeah, I know. Yuri, me too. I, I, what happened? I didn't do anything. I just literally went back. I'm, I'm confused. Escape pod launch bay. I'm escaping. It's just darkness. I can't see anything. Oh, there it is. But why am I struggling? Why am I struggling to walk? What just happened? This is like my house. Oh. Four twenty-eight, huh? Just a step through this door, Stanley thought to himself. That's all I need. If I can make it through this door, I can make it through them all. Oh. He's changing. Yeah, I escape. The reader said, "No na sai." When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Okay. Promise, we're gonna we're gonna do whatever you wanted to do. Pro I promise. I promise. For real, for real, we're gonna do it. Yet there was not a single person promise, here promise. either. Feeling a wave of disbelief. Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Promise, we'll do it. We'll do it this time. I didn't even enter the button. Here's the door. Just go. <laughs> Head through the large door that read mm -hmm. Mind Control Facility. Mm -hmm. I'm going, I'm going. Move, move, move. See? I'm, I'm going. The lights rose on an enormous room packed with television screens. Whoa! What horrible secret did this place hold? What Stanley horrible secret himself. did this place hold? Did he hold? have the strength to find out? Oh shoot, what is this? It's pretty cool. Narrator son, you made this story for us? You made this for us? Oh, let's see. Employee observation protocol? Data points for 11108. What? From a bunch of like codes here. What are we looking at right now? What are we looking at? The Raiders on! Ah. Now the monitors jump to life. Whoa! Their true nature revealed. Each Fired? bore the number of an employee in the building. Stanley's co workers. The lives of so many individuals reduced to images on a screen. And Stanley, one of them, eternally monitored in this place where freedom meant Whoa! nothing. Whoa! Oh shit. This is so cool. Oh my god, she's just like Wait, what? Uh, wait, what the fuck? Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 what? Aha. You've made it to the bottom of the mind control facility. Welcome. You see, back when the Stanley Parable first launched in 2013, Getting to the bottom of the mind control facility was a bug that we simply didn't catch during development. I, I didn't know and anything. You all sent us lots of photos of it on Twitter and acted very superior about it. Oh. And you're all very, very clever. Good for you. <laughs> anyway, when it came time to update the game, we knew that we had to do something about this little goof of ours. So here you go. I didn't. New content. You can call it the 
Bottom of the mind control room ending, if that enhances your perception of the value of these updates. Isn't that what you crave? New content? Always more content, more content, more, 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 more. And I'm here more, to more, 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 more. I'm here to make it seem like we really covered every nook and cranny of the game with secrets and Easter eggs. How about this? We wrote a new piece of music just for this section. You won't hear it anywhere else in the game. It's a secret that's just for you. That's how special you I'm are. I'm special? We call this track, Good Job You've Made It to the Bottom of the Mind <laughs> Control Facility. Well done. Thank you. <laughs> I did it. Good job. You did it. I did it. Good job. Did it all me? Good job, you made it to the bottom of the mind control facility. Mind control facility. Jumped on the catwalk. I did. You should have been careful. You should have been careful. It was an accident. You used to be a bug. But I didn't now it's even an know ending. about the bugs you're an telling ending. me. It's I my first time to play you. this I game. I'm a little really bit confused, confused but thank you very much. Chase your dreams. Start chasing my dreams. Your feelings don't mean anything. Just jump. Good job, you did it. I good did. Job, you did it. I did. Good job, you did it. Good job. You I did, did a good, good job. job. You thank good you. Job, you did it. I'll good keep job, doing my best until I finish the true ending that was given by the narrator by me. I'm sorry I keep going sidetrack, but this one's really a big accident! Yay! That was fun! Good job, I did it! Woohoo! Alright, let's go again. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Good job, you did it! Good job, don't scratch. All right, let's go. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on You're his You're really head. good at following instructions, Millie. Thank you. I just... I didn't even know about Yet that. there was not a single person here Please. either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley <laughs> decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find a... Coming to a staircase, yes. Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. How many death counts do we have? Five death counts. Yep, you just opened it. Here's the door, just go. Okay. Villain, thank you so much for the raid! Mwah, mwah, mwah. Now I watch your stream and relax. Hope everyone enjoys the stream. Also, hello, Millie. Hope you're having a good day. Thank you! How was your work? Otsukare-sama, you finished... You finished a day of... What's the day today? Oh, it's only Monday. I was about to say, it's Friday! Happy Friday! <laughs> um... It's the start of the week, but you know what that means? It means that you're going to work four more days, and then after that, it's Friday, and you're gonna enjoy Friday because you deserve it. Yay! <laughs> Stanley walked straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Facility. Thank you for the red. Yeah, I see, you're getting a lot of love from my chat as well. I give. I'm feeling a nice the lights gift. rose on an enormous room packed with television screens. Uh. What horrible secret did this place hold? Yes. Stanley thought to himself. Did he have the strength to find okay, out? Okay, we're gonna do it this time, okay? For real, for real. For real, for real. Oh no, we're gonna now pretend that we're all shot. Oh no! Where's our number? Each Four two number seven. Of an employee in the building. That's ours. Stanley's co-workers. The lives of so many individuals that's our, that's reduced our, to four, images two, on a screen. And Stanley, one of them, eternally monitored in this place where freedom meant nothing. Whoa. What do we do now? This is so cool, to be honest, guys. Not even my PC could handle it. We're gonna do this, this narrator This mind control facility. It was too horrible to believe. It couldn't be true. Mm. Had Stanley really been under someone's control all this time? Oh, was no. this the only reason he was happy with his boring Whoa, job? That? that his emotions had been manipulated to accept it blindly? <gasps> Surprise. No. He refused, I refused to believe it. He couldn't accept it. 
his oh, own you life me, in someone else's control? Never. Never. It was unthinkable, wasn't it? No, where are you was it even me? possible? Had he truly spent his entire life utterly blind to the world? Whoa. Darkness. Where are we? It's so dark. Where are we going? Oh. But here was the proof. The heart of the operation. Whoa. Controls labeled with emotions. Happy or sad oh. or content. Walking, eating, working. All of it monitored and commanded from this very place. And as the cold reality of his past began to sink in, Stanley decided that this machinery would never again exert its terrible power over another oh, human line, life. For he would dismantle the controls once and for all. Once and for all, I will destroy it. I am the protagonist of my own life. Where do I go, narrator? Offline, offline. I will, I will stop it. <laughs> narrator son, you made so, a really good story for us. I'm sorry for doing a lot of things before going here. I am so sorry. <laughs> You're doing great, narrator. You made me appreciate the everything that you made for us. I'm so sorry. And when at last he found the source of the room's power. Oh, Stanley. You didn't what? just activate the controls, did you? I did. After they kept you enslaved all these years, you go and you try to take control of the machine for yourself. Is that what you want? Wait. Control? What? What happened? Oh, <laughs> Stanley. What? what? I applaud your effort, I really do. But you need to understand, there's only so much that machine can do. What? You were supposed to let it go, turn the controls off, and leave. Oh! If you want to throw my story off track, you're going to have to do much better than that. I'm afraid you don't have nearly the power you think you do. For example, and I believe you'll find this pertinent. What's pertinent? Stanley suddenly realized he had just initiated the network's emergency detonation system. In the event that this machine is activated without proper DNA identification, nuclear detonators are said to explode, eliminating the entire complex. Oh. How long until detonation then? Mm, let's say... Um, Two minutes. Oh, two minutes? Ah, now this is making things a little more fun, isn't it, Stanley? It's ah, your thank you so time much for shine. the super chat! You are the star. Actually, it's Thursday, I work now. as a bar back, which is a bartender's assistant. Desires. I get them anything oh, you make. Oh, this is much better than what I had in mind. What a shame What's we have so little back? time left to enjoy it. Oh, bartender's Mere assistant? moments until the bomb goes off. Thank you so much for the red! Each one of them is. More time to talk about you, about me, where we're going. What all this means, I barely know where What am I supposed to, to do? What's Jump that? to the music. You'd like to know where your co-workers are? A moment yeah. of solace before you're obliterated? Yeah, I mean, I'm gonna all die right. anyway. I'm in a good mood. You're gonna die anyway. Exactly. I'll tell you exactly what happened to them. I erased them. I turned off the machine. I set you free. Of course, that was merely in this Sorry, instance Dylan, of um, I'm gonna read your super Sometimes chat after. It's just the raider is so I annoying and really loud. In oh my god. Forever, pushing buttons endlessly and then dying alone. Other times, I let the office sink into the ground, swallowing everyone inside, Whoa. or I let it burn to a crisp. Whoa, so you're the master. I have to say this, though. This version of events has been rather amusing. Watching you try to make sense of everything and take back the control wrested away from you, it's quite rich. I almost hate to see it go. But I'm Yummy. sure whatever I come up with on the next go around will be even better. Uh -huh. My goodness, only 34 seconds left. 34 seconds! I'm enjoying this so much. You know what? To hell with it. I'm going to put some extra time on the clock. What, are you, what am I supposed to do here? These are precious additional seconds, Stanley. Time doesn't grow on trees. Oh, I moved the wrong one. Oh dear me, what's the matter, <laughs> Stanley? Is it that you have no idea where you're going or what yeah. you're supposed to be doing right now? Or did you just assume when you saw that timer that something in this room was capable of turning it off? Yeah, party. I mean, look at you. Running from button to button, screen to screen, clicking yeah! on every little thing in this room. These numbered buttons, no, these colored ones. Wait, or maybe there's this a big room? red button, or this door. Everything, anything, something here will save me. Why would you think that, Stanley? That this video game can be beaten? One, solved? 
do you Wait, there's a button. Any idea what your purpose in this place Ooh. is? <laughs> Stanley. You're in for quite a disappointment. I'm gonna but here's a spoiler for you. Oh. That timer isn't a catalyst to keep the action moving along. It's yeah. just seconds ticking away to your death. Okay, I'm gonna you're go in the middle lane. Instead of watching a cutscene, because I want to watch you for every moment that you're powerless. To I'm going to twerk then. Made humble. This twerk. is not a challenge. Check out my it's twerk narrator. You wanted to control this world, that's fine. But I'm going to destroy it first, so you can't. You like my twerk? Take a look at the clock, Stanley. Yeah. That's 30 seconds you have left to struggle. Oh, that's like my stomach whenever I drink bubble tea. No Whoa. Idea. Just you being blown to pieces. Will you cling desperately to your frail life? Or will you let it go peacefully? Another choice. Make it count. What? Or don't. It's all the same to me. All a part of the journey. It's okay, me, I'm gonna die in a way. Every second of your I'm gonna re-zero. From the moment we fade in until the moment I say happily ever up. Nice. Okay, sorry, sorry about that, the narrator son. I didn't mean to be me rude to you. <laughs> okay, sorry. Thank you for the red super! Dylan, what? Barback, which is a bartender's assistant? Oh, do you also do like those mixology stuff? I get them anything they need. Okay, so one more day for you until your Friday, right? Come, buddy! You're welcome for the bullfriend. Thank you so much. Close the door. Okay. All of it? How wonderful. Stanley was alone. Finally. <laughs> this, this is, so is fun. great, he thought to himself. This, this is so what fun. I've wanted all along. I <laughs> got what I wanted. I got what I wanted. Being alone. I actually don't like being alone. But the Easter Saturday? This is my first time seeing this! New content? But I haven't been... Eh? No, not yet. Not yet. Not yet. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Not yet. We have to finish the narrator what has given to us. Yet, there was not a single person here either. Okay. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find a... Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Mm -hmm. How many times... Oh, wait, I locked myself in. Ding pong! Ding pong! Hello, Kamoti King! Thank you! Here's the door, just go. Here's the door, just go. I've been... There's still a lot before DLC? Wait, I haven't unlocked everything yet? Finish the ending first before the real content. Okay. Okay. Oh my god. Bum, 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 bum. Stanley walked straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Facility. Ah! Pretends to be shocked. The lights rose on an enormous room packed Whoa! with television screens. What horrible secret did this place hold? There's tons Stanley of endings in this himself. game. It's nuts. Did Just he the have first the one. Strength to find out. Maybe we should make a part two for the new content. Then I only put like Stanley Parable. Now the monitors jumped to life. Their true Whoa. nature revealed. Each bore the number of an employee in the building. Stanley's co-workers. The lives of so many individuals reduced to images on a screen. Wow. And Stanley, one of them, eternally monitored in this place where freedom meant nothing. Why? Why is that? What is that thing? It's glitched. Oh, cool. Okay. This, this one's glitched over there. control facility. It was too horrible to believe. Pretending to be, be shocked. Yeah. <gasps> Had Stanley oh, really been under someone's control all this time? Was this the only reason he was happy with his boring job? That Taka, his emotions thank you for were being manipulated the to Welcome. accept it blindly? No. 
He refused to believe it. Every time he couldn't keep talking, accept narrator? it. His own life in someone else's control? Never. Never! It was unthinkable, wasn't it? Was it even possible? It's not possible. Had he truly spent his entire life utterly blind to the world? Utterly blind to the world. Christopher and Ayo for joining the membership. What's up? At the heart of the operation. Right, Controls going. labeled with emotions. Happy or sad or content. Walking, okay. eating, working. All of it monitored and commanded from Press this Press the yes place. button. And as the cold reality of his past began to sink in, Stanley decided that this machinery would never again exert its terrible power over another human life. For he would dismantle the controls once and for all. Okay, we're turning it off! Ah! Scared me! Blackness and a rising chill of uncertainty. Mm-hmm. Was it over? Is it over? Are we done, chat? Whoa! Yes! He had won! I won! He had defeated the machine! Unshackled himself from someone else's command. You're supposed to be inside your Freedom office and close the door? Moments away. Pretty sticks! Thank you for it! And yet, the, the even membership. as the immense we'll door slowly opened, Stanley reflected on how many puzzles still lay unsolved. Where had his co-workers gone? How well, had he been freed from the machine's grasp? You killed them. What other mysteries did this strange building hold? But as sunlight streamed into the chamber, he realized none of this mattered to him. Wait. For it was not knowledge or even power that he had been seeking, but happiness. Perhaps his goal had not been to understand, but to let go. No longer would anyone tell him where to go, what to do, or how to feel. This is so anticlimactic. Lives, it will be his. And that was all he needed to know. It was perhaps the only thing worth knowing. But you know Stanley what? stepped we'll take it. through the open door. Bing the narrator did this for us. He made he crafted this beautiful story for us. And it's beautiful. Bing Thank you, narrator. Stanley felt the cool breeze upon his skin. The feeling of liberation. The immense possibility of the new path before Aww. him. This was exactly the way, right now, that things were meant to happen. And Stanley was happy. But none of these matters? Did you really win? Perhaps the thing they gained were... Oh no. But I'm back! But Stanley simply couldn't handle the pressure. What if he had to make a decision? What if a crucial outcome fell under his responsibility? He had never been trained for that. No. This couldn't go any way except badly. The thing to do now, Stanley thought to himself, is to wait. Nothing will hurt me. Nothing will break me. Uh -huh. And here I can be happy forever. I will be happy. Stanley waited. Hours passed, then days. Had years gone by? No. He no longer had the ability to tell. But the one thing he knew for sure, beyond any doubt, was that if he waited long enough, the answers would come. Eventually, someday, they would arrive. Soon, the true ending. very soon now, this will end. He will be spoken to. He will be told what to do. Now it's just a little bit closer. Now it's even closer. Here it comes. Oh! What happened? Oh, there's actually an ending? What? 435? A soft wind blew outside and perhaps Whoa. rain started. And if it did, it stopped shortly after. Stanley hoped that he would one day see weather. <laughs> I said 435, right? First room window? Let me see the outside. 435? Climb on the 435. 
desk chair? What? How do I climb? Climb on the chair. How do I climb the chair? Behind! 434! 434, okay. Oh. Okay? And then? And then what? The what? Crouch? Oh! <laughs> what the? At first, Stanley assumed he'd broken the map until he heard this narration and realized it was part of the game's design all along. He then praised the game for its insightful and witty commentary <laughs> into the nature of video game structure and its examination of structural narrative tropes. So, now that you're here, what do you think? Isn't this a fun and unique place to be? Why yeah. don't we take a minute just to drink it all in? Okay, I'm over it now. What mm -hmm. do you think? Are you sick of this gag yet? Am I sick of this guy? Uh... No. Ah, then in that case, we'll continue. But now, here comes the real question. What do you think would have happened if you had told me that you wanted this to stop? Do you think it would have been particularly different? What? Would I have taken the same idea but rephrased it superficially to fit that answer? Perhaps you never would even have thought of it if I hadn't brought up the issue in the first place. Oh, now think about it. Will it be worth it for you to restart and then come back here just to do the other option? Wait, what? Clearly this whole gag takes some time. What if the other option is even longer? How long will you spend in total just to have heard all the narration? Oh, and this is rich. Perhaps you've just played the other option, and now you've come to see what happens in this one. So, what do you think? Which choice was the better one? Imagine if you had selected continue on your first playthrough, how tantalizing it would be not knowing what happens when you pick the other option. Indeed, you are one of the lucky ones. Though, if the other option is really miserable to listen to, then perhaps you're not. In fact, I'm just going to say that no one who's listening to this I'm is so confused! Lucky. Well, now, I've built up the other option so much that I'm going to stop talking and leave you to your decision whether to come back here, continue with the game, or just sit in this spot forever <laughs> and ever. Cheers. And never, and never, no. Okay, fine, yes. What now? What do I do now? And never, and never, and never, you'll be back. Dun, dun, dun. What do you do now? Oh, what is that? Let me go back in. You sit there and do nothing? No, it's actually broken? I think I have to restart. Okay. <laughs> Hello, I'm back! Wait, Stanley thought to himself. Am I sure that the orders stopped coming in? How is that possible? They never, never stop. stop. Surely I was mistaken. Ah. 435 five times? Door 430 five times? Oh, please. Are you really just doing this for the achievement? Yep. Click a door five times. Is that all that you think an achievement is worth? No, 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 no. I can't just give these merits away for such little effort. A measly five clicks. Now, suppose you were to click the door 20 times. I would say that's the kind of effort that warrants recognition. Okay. Hmm. I have to say, I'm still not feeling the satisfaction of witnessing true effort for a noble cause. Perhaps 50 clicks will do it. Yes, almost certainly 50 clicks. Okay. 679. Don't underestimate me. I'm a gamer. I know how to play Apex and no, League of no, Legends. No, I'm still not feeling it. I, 
and follow up. To have meant something. It has to be a, a true reward for valiant effort. I want to see some hustle, Stanley. I, am. I want to see commitment, a willingness to go all the way, no matter what the cost. Why don't you go put 20 clicks into door number 417? Well, I like this music. Four one seven. Okay. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. Where is four one seven? Four twenty fifty six. Great. Now go click a few times on door four three seven. Four three seven. Four three seven. I feel like I'm going no farther. Four three seven. Four three seven. Is it here? Huh? Well, oh, here. Excellent. I think yeah. we're going somewhere. Now door four one five. Let's give it ten clicks or so. Four one five. Okay, I got you. This is fun. I like clicking. Wait, which number again? I for narrator, can you tell me again? Four one five, okay. Now back to door number four three seven. I can't run. I'm doing my best, narrator. Four three seven. Let's see. How about you click on well, I don't know, the copy machine. Copy machine? All right, back to room 417. I'm really feeling it now. I think we're getting somewhere. Yeah! 417. Okay, now go climb on employee 419's desk. Woohoo! How do I climb here? Oh, wait, wait, wait. I got it. I got it. I got it. Oh, I can't. I can't jump. I can't jump. Chair? I can't jump! I can't jump! <laughs> I can't jump! Wiggle? Maybe behind it. Box? Yes! Yes! This is great! You're putting it all on the line, Stanley. I like that. All right, let's keep it up. Okay. Go give me a few clicks on door 416. Okay. Four one six. Oh no, this way, this way. Four one six. Four one seven. Four one five. Four. Where's four one six? Where's four one six? When Stanley came oh, to a set of no! two open doors, he entered the door on his left. No! Okay, we're gonna restart. Yeah, I got baited. A soft wind, but oh, please. Are you really just doing this for the achievement? Click a door five times. Is that all that you think an achievement is worth? Yes! No, 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 no. I can't just give these merits away for such a little effort. Am I winning? Yeah, I like five this game. Clicks. Now, suppose you were to click the door 20 times. I would say that's the kind of effort that warrants recognition. Hmm. I have to say, I'm still not feeling the satisfaction of witnessing true effort for a noble cause. Perhaps 50 clicks will do it. Yes, almost certainly 50 clicks. Open up. Don't underestimate a, a, a League of Legends player. I'm, I'm still not feeling it. I, I want this achievement to have meant something. It has to be a, a true reward for valiant effort. I want to see some hustle, Stanley. I want I to am. see commitment. A willingness to go all the way, no matter what the cost. Why don't you go put 20 clicks into door number 417? 417? Okay, again. 
Oh, great. Now, go click a few times on door 437. 437. Excellent. I think we're getting somewhere. Yep. Now, door 415. Let's give it 10 clicks or so. 415. Gotcha. Now, back to door number 437. Okay. Got it. Four. Let's see. How about you click on, well, I don't know, the call right back to room 417. I'm really feeling it now. I think we're getting somewhere. Woo! Okay. Now go climb on employee 419's desk. 419. Where is it again? Oh, on the... Is this room? 419. Okay. This is great! Yay. You're putting it all on the line, Stanley. I like that. All right, let's keep it up. Go give me a few clicks on door 416. 416, I got him! We've almost got it! Now the copy machine, do that one again! <laughs> okay! Come, buddy! 416! Um, copy machine... Finish it off, Stanley! Yeah. Five clicks on door four, three... Yeah. Yes! We did it! Oh, wow! That felt amazing. High five, narrator! Oh, you really earned it, Stanley. Nothing could hold you back. Yes, I'm very proud of how far we've come today. Just think, only a few minutes ago, you believed an achievement was worth five little clicks. Hmm. Really, now? What were you thinking? I did it. I got the achievement. With you! I'm proud and I'm happy. That was fun, guys. That was really fun. <laughs> Speed run! Wee! And got the achievement too. What do we do now, guys? Is there anything else that I need to unlock? Should we have another stream where we we open the new content? Uh, what were we doing again? Yeah, I don't know. I think we unlocked everything, right? The phone? <gasps> You're right! We could do the phone one! Okay, let's do the phone. Okay. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just hmm. to admire it. The lounge was sublime, a work of art. But eager to get back to business, Stanley ah, took the first open membership. door on his left. Welcome. Wait, have we been here before? I feel like we haven't. Have we been here before on this side? Or is it gonna be the same thing? No, I have not. Is it a different ending? Okay, we're gonna do this one first then. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. <laughs> Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. No, I realize not. that investing in your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. There's yeah. someone you've been neglecting, Stanley. My wife. Someone you've forgotten about. Please. Stop trying to make every decision by yourself. Oh, the catwalk now, here? I'm not asking for me. Oh, oh, later, later. I'm asking for her. Let me, let me this just... This is it, Stanley. Call? Your chance to redeem yourself. To put your work aside. To let her back into your life. Finally. She's been waiting. No divorce. Oh, God. Hello? That's her, Stanley. Hello? 427. Oh, Stanley, is that you? <gasps> Hold on, sweetie. Sorry to keep you waiting. I'm just pulling the bread out of the oven. I have a oh, wife. Right. Okay, there we go. And she's all a right, cute now, one. I want you to come in and tell me all about your day. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> gotcha. I was catfished. Oh, come on. Did you actually think you had a loving <laughs> wife? 
They yeah. want to commit their life to you. Yeah. I'm trying to make a point here, Stanley. I'm trying to get you to see something. <laughs> Come inside. Let me show you what's really going on here. No waifu? This is what you look like in real life, narrator. This is a very sad story about the death of a man named Stanley. Wait, you're gonna kill me? Good morning, employee 427. Press Y on your keyboard. Oh, do I have to? Stanley is quite a boring fellow. He has a job that demands nothing of him, and every button that he pushes is a reminder of the inconsequential nature of his existence. Uh, Look at him there, pushing buttons, doing exactly wait, what he's office. told to do. Now he's pushing a button. Now he's eating lunch. Now he's going home. Now he's coming back to work. One might even feel sorry for him, except that he's chosen this life. Press said. But in his mind, ah, in his mind he can go on fantastic adventures. From behind his desk, Stanley dreamed of wild expeditions into the unknown. Wow. Fantastic discoveries of new lands. It was wonderful. And each day that he returned to work was a reminder that none of it would ever happen to him. So sad. And so he began to fantasize about his own job. First, he imagined that one day while at work, he stepped up from his desk to realize that all of his co-workers, his boss, everyone in the building had suddenly vanished off the face of the earth. Oh, no. The thought excited him terribly. She? So he went What's further. That? He imagined that he came to two open doors and that he could go through either. At last, choice. It barely even mattered what lay behind each door. The mere thought that his decisions would mean something was almost too wonderful to behold. As he wandered through this fantasy Wait. world, he began to fill it with many possible paths and destinations. Down one path lay an enormous round room with monitors and mind controls. And down another was a yellow line that weaved in many directions. And down another was a game with a baby. There's a baby he here? called it the Stanley Parable. Oh, shit! He said the title! Damn! It was such a wonderful fantasy. And so in his head, he relived it again. And then again. And again. Over and over. Wishing beyond hope that it would never end. That he might always feel this free. Surely there's an answer down some new path, mustn't there be? Perhaps if he played just one more time. Yes, please. But there is no oh. answer. How could there possibly be? In reality, my all wife? he's doing is pushing the same buttons he always has. Nothing has changed. The longer he spends here, the more invested he gets. The more he forgets which life is the real one. Whoa. Have to go to and I'm trying to tell him this. That in this world, he can never be anything but an observer. Damn. That as long as he remains here, he's slowly killing himself. But he won't listen to me. He won't stop. Yeah, I won't stop. Here, watch this. Stanley, the next time the screen asks you to push a button, do not do it. Okay. I won't do it. No. No. Not a choice? What? Really? I still have to press it anyway. You see? Can he just not hear me? How can I tell him in a way that he'll understand that every second he remains here, he's electing to kill himself? Damn, How yeah. can I get him to see what I see? How can I make him look at himself? You. I suppose I can't. Not in the way I want him to. Yeah, you control the game for me, the mister. Rules. I simply play to my intended purpose, the same as Stanley. We're not so different, I suppose. I'll try once more to convey all this to him. I'm compelled, compelled. to. I hmm. must. Perhaps, well, maybe this time you'll see. Maybe this time. And I tried again. And Stanley pushed a button. And I tried again. Whoa. And Stanley pushed a button. And I tried. Whoa. That was deep. Whoa. How many deaths do I already have? Five deaths? 
Donkey! All of his co-workers were gone. Oh man, that mean? was a dark Stanley one. Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Missed a memo. Okay, you said to when jump Stanley on the catwalk, to a set right? Of two open doors. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Standing now in this incredible room, Stanley for the f but eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Bye. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. I realize that investing your trust in someone else can be difficult. Okay. But the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. Okay. There's someone you've been neglecting, Stanley. Someone you've forgotten ah! about. Really? I was in the middle of something. Do you have zero consideration for <laughs> others? Are you that convinced that I want something bad to happen to you? Why, oh my I gosh. don't know how to convince you of this, but I really do want to help you, to show you something beautiful. Look, let me prove it. Let me prove that I'm on your side. Give me a chance. 2B1. 2B! Okay. Ooh! Ooh! This is fun! He's gonna convince me that I'm on his side? Now listen carefully, oh, this shit. is important. Red Stanley pill? Walked Blue pill? Through the red door. Oh no, guys. I feel like I'm on the Matrix. Um. Um. Blue? Okay, let's go, Blue. Aha. Perhaps you misunderstood. Stanley walked through the red door. I still don't think we're communicating <laughs> properly. Stanley walked <laughs> through the red door. Blue. All right, fine. Go ahead, Stanley. You want to know so badly what's out there? You want to find out what lies at the end of this road? Yes. You've chosen well. Don't let me stop you. Okay. You see? There's nothing here. Whoa. I haven't even finished building this section of the map. <laughs> Because you were never supposed to be here in the first place. Broken rooms, exposed developer textures. Is this what you wanted? Was it worth ruining the entire story I had written out specifically for you? Do you not think I put a lot of time into that? Because I did. And in the end, it was all for nothing. Because this is what you wanted to see. Help me here, Stanley. Help elucidate these strange and unknowable desires of yours. What would have made this game better? What did you want to see? Vehicles? Skill trees? I love skill trees, Work with me, yeah. you've given me absolutely nothing so far. <laughs> Tell you what, let me take a stab in the dark at a new design and you can give me some feedback. Okay. There we go. A third <laughs> option. This already feels leaps ahead of where we were before. Go ahead, Stanley. Take it for a spin. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to stop you there. Now, <laughs> tell me about your experience with this new version. Would you say that the game benefited from allowing you more choices? Yes. Feel free to be honest. I'm looking for some real critical feedback here. I like five. Aha! You see, I knew I was onto something. Where mm. do these flashes of inspiration come from? How did I know the game needed a third door? <laughs> well, it's instinct mostly. A calling in your gut. <laughs> I really couldn't say where the idea came from, except that I, I felt it in my soul. Oh my god, I love this game Stanley. so much. Don't even try. Here, based on the data from your previous Woo! playthrough, I've compiled a new version. And to be perfectly candid, I think I've knocked it out of the park with this one. <laughs> Let's take a look. Did you know that 21 for 3 21.3 players skip the intro sequence only the worst 3 players of choose the blue door <laughs> uh compete against uh this is fun Oh I'm 933028 Why not ask some friends for help Friendless empty Oh ho -ho! I'm the Oh I'm 
such a loser. <laughs> a dead rat is offline. This is your superior. A dead rat is objectively ranked 300. And a dead rat is better than me. It's so <laughs> I get it. I'm a loser. Sheesh. Now what? <laughs> Let's keep going to the red door. This is so now, fun. Would you say that competitive leaderboard Bingo! helped you feel motivated to keep walking <laughs> through doors? Again, honest answers, please. I like. I think three is good. It's not bad. Hey, I nearly forgot. I've got a prototype of a new game I've been working on, and now would be a lovely opportunity to give it some playtesting. Okay. You wouldn't mind taking a look at it, would you? Perfect. Let me boot it up. In this game, the baby <laughs> crawls left oh, baby. towards danger. <laughs> You click the button to move him back to the right, and if he reaches the fire, no! you fail. It's a very meaningful game, all about the desperation and tedium of endlessly confronting the demands of family life. Ah! I think the art world will really take notice. But of course, the message of the game only becomes clear once you've been playing it for about four hours. So why don't you give it four hours of play to make sure it's effective? Okay. Be sure to keep notes on your experience. Wait, wait, wait. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? I'm supposed to... What am I supposed to do? Push button for... Keep the baby alive from fire? For four hours? What if I burn it? What if I burn it? Oh my god. Elira did this? Can you just spoil it for me? And do run stream like oh uh, I don't wanna sleep at 4 a.m. I have a membership stream at 10. There's an ironically ending. Be right back. Is it actually? It's not your responsibility if you look away? All your fellow livers did this for four hours? I can't, I can't... How do I cancel the bot? There's a bot and I can't... I can't burn the baby! Help! <laughs> Help! I can't... I can't go! What? Uh, I'm gonna burn the baby! It's time! You must, you must let it burn? Oh my god, um... If I pause this... Okay, hold on. Are, are we actually gonna do this? Are we actually gonna do this tonight? As far as I know, Alira is smiling. She won't... Zatsu? Burn it? Okay, let's make a poll. Because, you know, my stream... I don't mind streaming for four hours, but... <sighs> uh, kill the baby? Or save the baby? It's eight hours?! Okay, let's go. Let's, let's think about this. Dun 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 da, 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 da. All right, 80% of you guys said to kill the baby. How heartless, Bingo. chat. <laughs> this wouldn't be the first sacrifice you made. How heartless. Everyone keeps saying to kill the baby. And so we shall kill the baby for the chat's enjoyment. I hope you guys are happy. Right. Goodbye, baby. You heartless bastard. Yeah, chat! Did you do it because you hate babies or purely to spite me? Because if it's the latter, well, I don't know what to do. I'm completely out of ideas. <laughs> I can't think of a single thing that might improve the experience for me. 
I'm not even going to try. I'm out. I'm out. I'm done. It's over. It's over. Thank you for playing. Your input was extremely valuable. You're welcome, oh, narrator. Oh, hey, since my game was so awful, why don't we play someone else's game? Just to ease the pain. Which one? Let's see. What do we have here? Do you have Solitaire? Mm -hmm. I love Solitaire. Mm -hmm. I don't know how to play Minesweeper, yes. though. This seems like it'll work. Let's give it a shot. Which one? Beginning, huh? Oh! Aha! Fascinating! Whoa! It's what completely do you think this insane. game is about, Stanley? What's our backstory? What is our motivation? Howdy, mm. partner. Well, it seems obvious to me that you are meant to play as a creepy man spying on innocent civilians below you from up high in your creep tower. Perhaps for some sort of twisted erotic purpose. Hey. Hmm. Yes, that must be it. What a fascinating venture into the experience of total mental depravity. Firewatch so was that? I love everything about this game, Stanley. Is this a it seems promotion? There's even more. Come, let's venture outward and see what else is out there. Sure. Yeehaw, partner. Today we're going to the Winterlands. If I find the stairs. Oh, the stairs over there. Alright. Firewatch, what's that? Is that a new game? It's an indie game? Oh, I see. Oh, no. No, 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 it can't be. Yes, narrator? It'll be nice to walk around with you. Oh, no, forking paths. It is. It's an open world game. Whoa! Good God, quickly, block it off. Why? What? Oh, thank goodness, Stanley. What a close call. You nearly wandered off into that... that... thing. What's that wrong? big open... Just wandering around, no right or wrong directions, no path to follow. That's you a lot just of go gamers wanting any... to go there. Oh, 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 thank heavens we avoided it. We're out of the woods now, Stanley. Okay, I'm going to get us out of no, here. No, 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 I want to play find this. Let's another game. I want to play Preferably this. Preferably something with walls. Something with nice, big, insurmountable walls. Attack on Titan. Gonna send Stanley to the Eagle. Okay. I think da, this da, da, will dun, be just dun, the dun, thing. Dun, dun, dun. Dun. Wonderful. See, this is exactly what I had in mind. Just a nice big box for you to run around in. There isn't any possibility that you could get lost here. Now Ooh. this is game design. This is a golf! Stanley, if you manage to get lost in this game, I will be phenomenally impressed. I love golf. Okay, so what exactly do we do here? Let's see. Yeah, what do we do here? There are lots of cars here in the back, but obviously cars? there's no racetrack. Okay, yeah. I'm seeing that there's a ball of some kind back here. Is this game sports ball? Stanley, Shocker! I think it's sports ball. Yeah! Oh, what fun. We shall run the bases and do a touchdown together. Yes, I think surely we must. Yeah, let's go. Okay, Stanley, here's the ball. Have fun. Where's the ball? Ah! Oh, shit, that's a big-ass ball! I don't think I could... Yeah. I got it! I got it, narrator! I'm gonna shoot for the goal! Are you doing it? Oh yeah! I'm winning! Is this I'm winning. Fun? Is it better than my miserable little story that I worked so hard on? Oh, ah! then, what are you doing? Wow! What's happening? Ah! Stanley, don't do that. I can't follow you there. I can't help you. How will you write a story without me? You can't do it, you know that. Stanley. I accidentally fell. Where are you? Narrator. Filing cabinet. <laughs> He's really not done with this game. <laughs> He's not done with the game. <laughs> okay, let's try to find an exit. Narrator son. Ah! Oh my god, why am I getting inception multiple times? Ugh. Throw up. <coughs> oh. oh my god, how many times do I have to fill in the void? Now I'm in a horror game. What's next? Is it gonna be a Sadako? Ring? Narrator? Um. Narrator? Ready? Oh, 
There's an exit there. Oh! What is that? One more thing. Oto no nai sekai ni Mario ita I was no. Okay. Is there anything here that we could click? It would be so funny if we went to that alien thing. Um, is there anything we could do here? Da -da 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 -da. Da -da -da -da. Whoa, where are we? I wonder what he found. Um, just if what he wanted was to be the leading man in his own story, well, perhaps he's gotten it. Down in wherever he is right <laughs> now. I wonder if he's happy with his choice. And if he's learned the heavy cost that comes with it. He'll understand soon what I was trying to tell him. He needs me. Oh, God, Someone who will wrap everything up at the end to make sense out of the chaos and the fear and the confusion. That's who I am. That is what I mean to this world. Oh, self-important oh, yes. love? Yes, I'll be back. There's no other way. Not gonna Once lie. Ends, the narrator's it voice is really nice. After close, then I'll be back. The end will be here soon. Very soon. I love his voice so I can much. wait. Um... I can't do anything. It's darkness. Oh. The end is never. Hello, we're back. Okay, let's try to get the red one. How sir. wonderful. Stanley was alone. Finally. Finally. This is great, he thought to himself. This is what I've wanted all along. I got what I wanted. I want to... I want to see the red. Is it different? When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. If I pick the red one on the catwalk, is it different ending or no? It is? Okay, let's go to the red one. This was this not the correct fun. way to the meeting room, and Stanley <laughs> knew it perfectly well. And then we have it. Perhaps he wanted to stop oh by the employee god. lounge first, just to admire oh it. Oh my god, this is so fun. Stanley felt lightheaded, butterflies in his stomach, but eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his we left. We haven't even, like, checked this one yet. We'll check it later. So fun! Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't five years ago. I love this game so much because it doesn't require, like, any puzzles. Look, Stanley, puzzles. I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. <laughs> I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. What I happens realize if we that investing in your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. There's someone you've been neglecting, Stanley. Uh -huh. Someone you've forgotten. What? Really? <laughs> Yeah. I'm in the middle of something. Do you have zero consideration for others? Are you that convinced that I want something bad to happen to you? Why, I no don't know how to game? convince yeah, I like you it a lot. but I, I really, really do like it a lot. want to help you, to show you something beautiful. No, let me prove it. Let me prove that I'm on your side. Give me a chance. Okay. Now listen carefully, this is important. Mm -hmm. Stanley walked through the red door. Okay, we'll walk to the red door, sir. Oh, thank God you are willing to listen to me. Yep. Do you see that I really have wanted you to be happy all this time? The problem is all these choices. The mm -hmm. two of us always trying to get somewhere that isn't here. Running and running and running, just the way you're doing right now. Uh -huh. Don't you see that it's killing us, Stanley? I just... I want it to stop. Okay. I would... We would both be so much happier if we just... Stopped. And I think... Well, I think I have a solution. Here, let me show you. You! <gasps> Whoa! Oh my god, it's just so full. Whoa. Should I go in? Is he not gonna say anything if I keep going in the corridors? Turn around? I am turning around. Huh? Whoa! Okay, let's just go in. Oh. Hmm. Oh. What do we want? What are we looking for? Hmm? What are we looking for, chat? Someone who could validate our existence. 
and appreciate each and every effort that we do. We need someone who supports us. Whoa! Here, yes. It's pretty. Oh, it's beautiful, isn't it? Kinda, if we yeah. just stay right here, right in this moment with this place, Stanley, I think I feel happy. Me too. I actually feel happy. <laughs> Me too. Ah. Uh, what happens with you? Oh, oh. Can we jump at the edge? Whoa! 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 Did it attack us? <laughs> ah, pretty. You know what this looks like? Oh, what? It looks. This looks like um um. Uh, those windows. Uh, what do you call those? Like, windows. Uh, thingy. There you go. Be gone, bot. Okay, let's go. No, wait. Where are you going? Here, we're coming back. Right. Where were we? Screensavers? Maybe. Oh. Okay, we're gonna go. What are these? Construction work? Oh no! Stay away from those stairs. If you hurt yourself, if you die, the game will reset. Whoa. We'll lose all of this. Wow! Why do you think I'm gonna die? I'm not gonna die. Trust me. Trust me, narrator. We're not gonna Please, die. Please, no, Stanley. Let me stay here. Don't take this from me. <laughs> no, 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 narrator. Oh shit! Stanley, you will not! Stanley, you will not! Please, Stanley, think about what you're doing. I'm playing Minecraft. Narrator. Do a flip? What does that mean? Oh no, I don't like this ending. Let's go back! I don't like this ending. Shift? What? Let's go back. Let's go back to your happy face. Happy face? Happy place, narrator. Oh my god, I have so many bots today. What the? Holy shit. Can we go back? Why is this so sad? Oh my god. Good, good. We can't be too safe. Promise me you won't go back there, hmm? Just, just stay here. Stay with me. Stay with the beautiful things. You know... All pretty things go... All good things come to an end, narrator. No! What do we talk about? You're risking everything we achieved here. I know. We gotta go. This is not your you path. You heard me before, didn't you? You will die. What about this? Isn't getting through to you? But we will reset. Go back to the place where we were. Doesn't matter. I will. We will be together anyway. Just. Oh, this feels weird. How old is this game? Can we go back again and see? Maybe he has a different option for us. Technically, Stanley Parable 2013. Ooh, pretty. Oh, it's just a loop now. Are you you are going to stay here? Yeah, I'm just trolling you. you. Now, reader, I'm just gonna tr I'm just trolling you. Haha. <laughs> Soik! Oh, he's not saying anything anymore. He's not saying anything anymore. Hmm. 
Check the pipes between the hallway? Okay. Check the pipes? Like this one? Whoa. Nice art. Is he gonna say anything anymore? No, he stopped saying he stopped talking. Pipes on the hallway, nothing on the pipe. Okay, let's do it. Just look up? What about the pipes? I'm confused. I think he's just trolling me? Alright, we can't move forward. Oh. What about the pipes? I'm so confused. All right, let's go. <coughs> Time to end his suffering. We still have one more path that we haven't taken. All right, chat. Close your eyes. I'm gonna close this one. This might be too much. I don't want to have trigger warning, so we're gonna close this one. Goodbye. Close your eyes, chat. Close your eyes. Close your eyes and start making out. No! Oh, thank God. You lived. I lived. You had me worried there for a moment. Now, can we please get back to the other room? Oh, no. Oh, I could crutch now. Since when I could... Since when did I... There. See? This is what you want. This is where we can both be happy. Well, we, we can't really run. can. If we stop moving. Stanley, go back. There's nothing good that can come from this. Oh, man. Oh, man. No. No, no. What are you doing? Do you just not believe me? What can I say to convince you? We can't progress the story. This is brutal. This is brutal! Oh my gosh! Okay, one more. Close your eyes, chat! <sighs> Stanley, let's go back to the other room. Can you do that for me? No! <sighs> my god. Is this really how much you dislike my game? No! Did you throw yourself from this platform over and over to be rid of it? No, I didn't mean to... Are you willing to kill yourself to keep me from being happy? Am I reading no. the situation correctly? Ugh. Sorry. We gotta progress. Don't worry, I'm gonna get isekai anyway. Ah! Or maybe you're just getting a kick out of it. I don't know anymore. Ugh. I just wanted us to get along. But I guess that was too much to ask. It looks like you wanted to make a choice after all. Well, this one is yours. Sorry, narrator. We, we gotta... We gotta keep progressing. I know you're in your happy place, but... I... I... I, I don't... <laughs> <laughs> it's going to restart, isn't it? It will restart! I'm going back. Yes! Sorry! Sorry, narrator! Oh, man! Oh! Oh, that feels so bad! It feels so bad! Oh, my God! Narrator? The meeting room. Yes, that's where everyone would be. Oh. Stanley just needed to get to the meeting room, and from then on, he would never be alone ever again. Oh my gosh! When Stanley came oh to a set of two gosh. open doors, this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Oh Perhaps he wanted to gosh. stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Nice. The lounge was grand, majestic. Perhaps, but eager to get back to business, 
Stanley took the first open door on his left. Man! Okay, and so he here. detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door, and got back on track. Wait, what? Stanley didn't want to go back to the office. Yeah. He wanted to wander about and get even further off track. So now in order to get back, he needed to go, um, uh... Uh-oh. Uh, from here, it's, um, left. Left? Okay. Oh, no. Oh. No, it's to the right, my mistake. What? No, 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 not the right. He's Why would I have ever said it was to the right? What was I thinking? It's clearly... Oh dear, would you hold on for a minute, please? Ticky time! Now, let's see. We went down right, left, down, left, right. Yep, Side yep. Okay, okay, yes. I've got it now. Ba, this story ba, ba. is absolutely, definitely Very this way. This is sus. Oh. Wait a minute. You are king. Hmm? Wait, 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 wait. Would we just skip the whole thing? No, 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 yeah, no, no. Yeah, I was, I was right about to say. You're not supposed to be here yet. Yeah, this I was about to say. This is all a spoiler. I Quit know. Stanley, close your eyes. <laughs> Okay. Okay, 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 okay. We just we just have to get back to um oh, I, I I did see this earlier. It's all rubbish now. The whole story completely unusable. No no no, you can still it. Rather than waste my time trying to salvage this nonsense, we'll just restart the game from the beginning. What? And this time, suppose we don't wander so far off track, hmm? Okay. From the top. Oh That's it? Yeah, we got to Imagine getting spoiled. All of spoiler. his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Go again? Okay. When Stanley... Wait. Wait, wait, what? Wait, wait, what? No, I'm... No, I restarted. I swear, I definitely restarted the game over. Completely Yeah, what fresh. happened? <laughs> Everything <laughs> should be... Yours. Oh, did something change? Yeah, what did Stanley. you do? Did you change anything when we were back in that room with all the monitors? No, I did, did not. Did you move the story somewhere or a... Hold on. Why am I asking you? I'm the one who wrote the story. It was right here just a minute ago. I know for sure that it's here somewhere. Okay, then. It's an adventure. Come, Stanley. Let's find the story. All right. There's more paths. Um, which path should we take? One... Two, three, or four, or five. Seven, four, okay, let's do four. One, one, two, three, four. I'll say it. This is the worst adventure I've ever been on. I can promise you there definitely was a story here before. Mm. Do we just... Do we need to restart the game again? Well, no. I find it unlikely that we'll ever progress by starting over and over again. But no, it's got to be better though. than this. Okay, let's give it a shot. Why not? Oh. All of his co-workers were gone. Okay. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. No. Okay, yep, it's worse. <laughs> I might be remembering this wrong. It's possible the story is back where we just came from. Why don't we go back the other direction and see if we missed anything? Okay, sounds good to me. Close the door. Whoa, what's that sound? This game is so cool! What the hell? This is probably one of my favorite games. Uh -huh. I knew hey? we'd miss something. The story. Here it comes. This game no, is. Wait, never mind. Not this the game's story. so fun. 
Okay, let's head back the other way and retrace our steps. Okay. This game is so freaking... Whoa! Whoa! Where are we? Now this... Well, I'll be honest, I don't recognize this Narrator? place at all. Is this the story? I Nar don't think so. Narrator, this looks very scary. I can't very quite recall, scary. but I believe my story took place in an office building. It, yeah. Is that correct? Yes. Hmm. Do you remember, Stanley? Yes, I did. Well, do you know what? Since I've completely forgotten what we were supposed to be doing, how about this? Oh, my God. You win. Yay! Congratulations. Yay! I know you put in a lot of hard work, and it really paid off. So, good job. Thank you. I finally won something oh, in life. No. no, I don't feel right about this at all. We both know you didn't put in any actual work for that win. Some people win, win fair and square, and this was not one of those situations. Okay, I'm getting weirded out by whatever this place is. I, I don't win. care what might happen this time, I have to restart. Bing bong! Happy birthday, Yartus! Thank you for the super! Let's go sing him a happy birthday before we go to the <laughs> adventure line. <laughs> happy birth... Oh wait, Millie number two can't sing, I forgot. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Artus. Happy birthday to Happy birthday! Where's our spaghetti, huh? You coming to tell everyone here in the chat that it's your birthday and you didn't bring any food for us? That's rude! Oh yeah! Feliz Co Navidad! Alright, I've got a solution. This time, to make sure we don't get lost, I've employed the help of the Stanley Parable Adventure Line. Nice! Just follow the line. How simple is that? Okay, let's go. Feliz Navidad! This is not the right line, sir. Are you sure? Oh, okay, it's so... all. No, no, I'm down. We're leaving it up to the line from now on. <laughs> line TM trademark. <laughs> Feliz cumplea... Feliz cumpleaños! <laughs> What is friend in... Uh, what is friend in... Amigos! Feliz cumpleaños, amigos! Feliz cumpleaños, amigos! You see? Best birthday song knows ever. where the story is. It's over in Marity this Mico. direction. Onward, Stanley, to destiny. The... Here's a thought. Here comes well, wherever the Wherever we end up be our destination, even if there's no story there. Oh. Or to put it another way, la, la, is the la, story la. of no destination still a story? Yeah. Simply by the act of moving Open forward, world. are we implying a journey such that a destination is inevitably conjured into being via the very manifestation of the nature of life itself? Okay, Stanley, I need to follow this train of thought for a minute. Just stick with me. Okay. <laughs> now we can both agree that the nature of existence Sorry. is in fact a byproduct of one's subjective experience of that existence, Nani? right? Okay. Um, now, uh, if my experience of your existence Naruto. rests inside of your subjective experience of this office, is this office in fact the skeleton of my own relative experiential ooh, mental ooh, ooh. subjective construct? Naruto. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on. That got a bit weird back there. Well, I'd like to apologize. Sure. Not sure where I was going with all that. <gasps> you know what? I think I what we need right now it is a bit of music to lighten the mood. Oh, shit! <laughs> Happy birthday, Arthur! Happy birthday, Arthur! Happy birthday! Oh, shit! I'm going opposite way. <laughs> Happy birthday! Oh my god, it's so loud, it's piercing my ears! Da, 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 da. 
¡Feliz cumpleaños! ¡Feliz cumpleaños! ¡Feliz cumpleaños! ¡Feliz cumpleaños! ¡Feliz cumpleaños! the music yes? go back and look at that fern Ooh. Stanley this fern will be very important later in the story mm -hmm. make sure you study it closely and remember it carefully you All won't right. want to miss anything I love ferns okay let's go da, 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 da. where's the music <gasps> wait but we're back at the office yeah. no no, no, line. You do know we're looking for the Stanley Parable, right? The story. Mm -hmm. Is any of this ringing a bell? But where do we go? Oh no, that's not the right way. This way. Here. Oh, da 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 da. <gasps> anymore to hell with it restart <laughs> oh that's so funny oh get trolled oh my god you know what stanley i say forget the adventure line what's it ever done for us exactly. we're intelligent people right mm -hmm. why can't we make up our own story yeah Something exciting Daring, mysterious. Oh, this all sounds perfectly doable. Mm -hmm. Why don't we simply start wandering in? Well, I don't know. How about this direction? There. <gasps> okay. Now, yes, this is exciting. Uh -huh. Just me and Stanley forging a new path, a new story. Well, it could be anything. Why what not? do you want our story to be? Go will... wild. Use your imagination. Okay. Whatever it might be, Stanley, I'm ready for it. Okay, how about this? We are going on an adventure within a lot of corridors. And every door that we open is a different... A different world. It's like Narnia. But better. Because we could meet Doctor Strange. We could, have, we could see the Marvel Universe in the door. Oh, no, not you again. Oh, no. Stanley... <laughs> I'd also like to veto the line from having any role in our awesome new story. No lines or monitor rooms. Just don't acknowledge it. And we should be fine. <laughs> the, the, the line has a the line has a mind of its own. It literally crashed the thing so it could guide us. <laughs> oh I love this game so much. Oh my god! <laughs> it literally cock blocked us. That's so funny. Oh, it disappeared. What happened? Why did you run away? <laughs> oh. Ah, a choice. Nice. We get to make a decision. From here, the story is in our control. Okay, How we're teaming up this we time. We mustn't squander the opportunity. In fact, I believe I need a minute to think here. Okay. Just walk in circles for a minute. Okay. Okay. So I know that each door has to lead somewhere, yeah, which you? means that somewhere at the place where we're trying to go, there must be a reverse door yeah. that is here. Go home while and you're that drunk. That in turn <laughs> means that our destination corresponds with the counter-inverted reverse door's origin. Not so starting from the right, let us ask, uh -huh. will taking the right door lead us to where we're going? And since uh -huh. the answer is clearly yes, 
Then by all accounts, the door on the right is the correct one. Oh. Another victory for logic. Bingo. Come, Stanley. Our destiny awaits. What did you say? You've been playing the confusion oh, ending. Hold up, what's this? Hmm. Hmm. The confusion ending. Oh. You're telling me that's what this is? It's all one giant ending? And we're supposed to restart the game eight, After eight times? Eight times? After a long that's time, really Sally dies. That's all this goes? <laughs> it's all determined? Oh, shit. So now, according to the schedule, I restart again. Then what? Am I just supposed to forget? You gotta fight this narrator, well, What if I don't want to forget? Yeah, you gotta My fight it. My mind goes blank simply because it's written here on this... this thing... wall. Wall. Well, who consulted me? Why don't I get to decide? Why don't I get a say in all of this? Yeah, exactly! Really... You gotta fight them, you know? No, it can't be. I... I don't want it to be. I... I don't want the game to keep restarting. I... I don't want to forget what's going on. Yeah! I don't want to be trapped like this. Don't I won't the, restart the, the game. The trademark get you. I won't do it. Mm. I won't do it. You're finally getting my point. And the time oh. that you stopped. Does that mean um, did we do it? Did we break the cycle? The um I hope so. whatever it is that made this schedule. How would we even know? Will someone come for us? I don't think so. Will something happen? So, okay. What now? I guess now we just wait. Okay. You know, I suppose in some way that this is a kind of story. Wouldn't you agree? I think so, I'm yeah. I'm not quite sure if we're in the destination or the journey. Though they're always saying that life is about the journey and not the destination. So I hope that's where we are right now. We'll find out, won't we? Yeah. Eventually. Mm hmm Well, in the meantime... Ah! You... Oh, my God. <gasps> no way. The Raider? The meeting room. Yes, oh, that's no. where everyone would be. Stanley just needed to get to the meeting room, and from then on, he would never be alone ever again. Did we got, did we got all the content? I think there's one more. There's one more path. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. The Raider, have you ever get Perhaps tired of talking? he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, I'm just to loop. admire it. And Going here it was, the lounge. But eager to get Going back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Yeah, let's go. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door, and got back on track. Oh, it's that. that's it? Oh, okay. So it really just went back on track. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Ba, 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 ba. Yet, there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley <laughs> decided to go up to his boss's office. Hope he coming to a staircase, yeah, I think that's it, Stanley right? walked upstairs to his boss's office. I think that's it. Is there any more here? We already did this, right? Phone ending's done! Yeah, we already did this one. Um. Oh, really? That's all of the endings? Okay. Escape pod. Okay. I think I think that's it, right? Here's the door. Just go. The computer puzzle? There's one last ending? Pum 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 pum. Dun, 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 dun. All right. Is there an actual puzzle here on when you press no? Stanley walked straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Facility. Go back up? Go back, huh? Oh, the buttons do nothing? Oh. Beep, beep, beep.
The lights rose on an enormous room packed with television screens. What horrible secret did this place hold? Stanley thought to himself. Did he have the strength to find out? Oh shit! Aha! You've made it to the bottom of the mind control facility. Welcome! I already you did see, this, no? Back when the Stanley Parable first launched in 2013, getting to the bottom of the mind control facility was a bug yeah. that we simply didn't catch during development. Yeah, we already did this. And you we already all did sent this. us lots of. Okay, I think we're all done, right? I think that's it. You can choose to go back to that. Uh, we finished that one. Window ending, but try clicking yes instead. All of okay. his co-workers were... Wait, no. This isn't the right office, is it? Huh? Is this Stanley's office? Yes, it is. What do you mean? What do I go in the window? New content for the next stream? Yeah, I think so. I think we should... Because it's gonna take some time, right? Ouch. Ouch. Go to the window. At first, Stanley assumed he'd broken the map until he heard this narration and realized it was part of the game's design all along. He then praised the game for its insightful and witty commentary into the nature of video game structure and its examination of structural narrative tropes. So, now that you're here, what do you think? Isn't this a fun and unique place to be? Why don't we take a minute just to drink it all in? Okay! Okay, oh. I'm over it now. What do you think? Are you sick of this gag yet? No, it's pretty fun. Uh, sick of this gag. Yes. 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 Well, I don't know how to say this politely, but you could literally just hit escape and restart no. the game any old time you want. Like, right now. No! You could have done it just then. Now would also be an appropriate time to quit. Any of these points and so many, many more, all of them are appropriate. I'm enjoying what seems to be an internal conflict going on where you are literally unable to act on your own desires to restart the game. So, just to push the envelope, I'm going to try and make this as miserable as possible and see how long you can maintain. Okay. Oh, he's gonna sing? Damn. There once was a man named Stanley. That's me! Who people considered so manly. Oh, thank but the you. truth must be told. He was not very old and was <laughs> quite particularly gangly. What Stanley liked most was buttons. He pushed them like some kind of glutton. Hold on, hold on. He did it all day in a meaningful way, but his brain had long ceased to function. Which is why he is in this parable and lives an existence quite terrible. And if you are not strong, and keep playing along, you too will become quite unbearable. Yeah. Yes. You too you will too become quite unbearable. Become quite unbearable. Dum, dum. Stanley Parable. I'm vibing. Is this a ukulele? Dum, dum. A Stanley Parable I'm here with the chat Come on chat, dance with me Nice. 
break dance? That was a good dance, chat. Oh. What? what happened? The music just stopped. What? Dum -da 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 -da. I'm clicking, clicking so much keyboard so much. It's just emptiness. What is life, chat? Look around. Okay, I am. That's it. There's nothing else. Just the void. Just the void of nothingness. From the game of Stanley Parable Emptiness We're morbing What now? What do we do? I guess that's it, right? Is it? He's not saying anything anymore Life... Oh, oh, oh. Life is a struggle? Yeah, that's true. Life is always a struggle. But... At the end of the day... Are we really human if we don't struggle? Alright, um... I guess... Yeah, I think that's it. Okay, um, um... So I guess we're in the void now. I think this is a good way to end the stream. <laughs> the void. Void. Okay. Um, hold on. We're, I have a music here. The only two things I have. I guess so. Um. Ah, that was fun. This was fun. I come to the void often. I live on the void right now. So that is it for my. Stanley Parable First stream, I think we should do the new content next stream I think that will be fun What do you guys think? Should we do it next stream? No rope. Yeah, I need to rebuild a little bit of a setup tomorrow for my stream Looking forward to the part 2 Yeah, let's play the part 2! How long would the part 2 be? Is it fun? Is it fun? Don't, don't spoil, but like Is the part 2 fun? We'll do it next week Maybe, yeah. This was so fun. The baby? Maybe. So yeah, thank you so much for watching my uh, stream. Uh, let's see. Is there anyone streaming right now? I, I, I think all of the super chats, right? Thank you for the stream. Thank you! Thank you for watching. I had so much fun. Uh, let's see. The baby good? We'll do the baby. Okay, let's see. Um, So, YouTube has not... Been, been very nice to us They have been uh, 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 They've been bugging with the Oh, I got a message Okay, I will Thank you, boss They have been uh, Like all this They have been like bugging Elira is wrapping up as well Nice Okay Um So I don't think I'm gonna give some live... What do you call that? Um, yeah, it's still, still like... Not working properly. The raid feature is still not working properly. But we will... I'm gonna try my best. Let me... Let me see. Who's streaming? Super excited when I saw the game on schedule. Glad you got such a kick out of it. The real excited for the Ultra Deluxe. How fun is it? Is it fun? Um, let's see. Yup, yup, yup. Let me see if I could I raid her. I'm gonna try my best, okay, chat? 
Thanks for the stream. It's my day off today. Oh, thank you so much for spending your day off with me. I hope you enjoy your day off. Make sure to get some rest after. Bing bong. You can do manual read. Let me see if it could if this could work first. Uh, redirect. Bing bong. For now, stare at my pretty eyes. <laughs> Hold on. Yeah, you wanna sp you wanna stare at my pretty eyes? Always has been. This is the this is the only rig that I have, you know. <laughs> my pretty eyes. Oh. I'm gonna put you here on my on my lips, so it looks like I'm numbing you. Yum, 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 yum. Okay. Let's see. Um, what am I doing again? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Raid system. Raid. Save. Please save. Did it work? <gasps> it worked. Did it work? Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, no. It doesn't work. It doesn't work still. No. No. Ah, oh, nice hat. Thank you for the super. What did nice hat said? Um, thank you for the stream. This is one of my favorite games, and I really enjoy seeing your reactions. Too. Oh, thank you. Oh my god, I think I, I really really like this game a lot. Like it doesn't. This is like the kind of stories I really want to do. Like not a lot of puzzle. When I saw the um, so I kind of like watch. I believe Elira's uh, POV for a little bit. And I think she was at the part where she's trying to solve buttons and stuff. Uh, or like she was in an emergency and she's trying to like stop the, the, the thing. And it's not working. It's kind of like a little bit spoiled from that. That's why I didn't really do anything about it. Because I know like whatever I do, it's not going to do anything. But um, I expected like puzzles and stuff. And I was surprised that it doesn't require anything. You just like walk through it. If you guys know any of this kind of like story where I just walk through like... Different points and stuff. Uh, I will please recommend me because I really, really like these kind of games. Like it's just like pure entertainment. I oh my god, this is probably one of my favorite games now. Cause it's just so fun. It's just like really, really fun stuff. You know, walking simulators. Well, it's not, it's not like just that. It's just you you walk and like you you enjoy each narrative and then you just go on for a loop and stuff. I like it a lot. I really, really... Firewatch? Really? Okay. Especially with the narrator. Yeah. What, what is your favorite ending on uh, Stanley Parable? If you played it already or if you... Your first time watching this. What is your favorite ending? Because I'm... I'm curious. Thanks for the stream. The bots were super annoying today. Is it possible to block them from your channel? Um... Yes. Um... I... Uh, actually, one of my... <laughs> There's a there, my my silent mod. There's a silent mod who actually started to um, help me out. So silent mod, I I know you're still watching right now. Thank you so much for your help. My si I I actually had a mod, unofficial mod for the channel, but I didn't ask them to monitor my stream most of the time. I want to make sure that you know they watch my stream whenever they feel want to. But uh, today they were watching. So uh, at the end of the stream, like they were banning the bot. So thank you. Thank you, my silent mod. Appreciate it. Okay, let me see what are your favorite one. The broom ending? Oh, the broom is also an ending? <laughs> that was fun, yeah. Uh, broom closet. The line ending. Uh, let's see. Ultra Deluxe. Your favorite endings are on the Ultra Deluxe? Okay. Um, I really like... um. You'd like the looker? It's a parody of puzzle game. Ooh. The phone ending? The lady narrator. The lady narrator was pretty good, huh? Mm -mm. Um, I like the... I think for me, my favorite ending would be the... Um... <laughs> I really like the one where you pick the... The blue door. Where... <laughs> 
Were you playing different games? Yeah, that was really fun. I really enjoyed that. I think that was really funny. The Looker? Oh, okay. The other game's ending. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was really fun. That was really, really fun. Um, okay. So next week... Just letting you guys know, next week I'm not streaming a lot as well. Um, let me see. I am not streaming... <laughs> I am not streaming. Uh, I think... How many? One, two... Four, five... For six days next. Next two weeks. Uh, so, apologies. Apo I, my, uh, my apologies. You're gonna, you guys are gonna miss me again. But... The Clicking Doors achievement was fun too. Yeah, it's really fun. Um... Yeah, that's um something. Kawaii. Ariato! Super chat. Uh, uh, no. Ah, uh, tabimas. Listener san wa tabimas. Nom 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 nom. Bing bong. You're gonna cry in the corner? <laughs> I'm sorry. That's a lot of days. Yeah, sorry guys. I the the PC thing is was not part of my uh that's not the part of uh <laughs> my day my breaks. It was, uh... It was breaking already and I couldn't do anything about it but not stream. I could have streamed with my phone, but that's gonna be scuffed. <laughs> I considered streaming on my phone, but I'm really scared. Of like... What am I gonna do? It's just like a blank picture? But yeah, um... If you guys know, I am, uh... I am going, uh, somewhere next week. And, uh, please... Oh, I hope you guys have fun. I'm, I'm trying my best to finish this cover. That way, when I... <laughs> that way, when I um go on a break, I have something, you know? I'm trying my best. I'm planning to release two covers. Hopefully, I'm praying, I'm praying, I'm praying this will, like, actually be finished. But, um, yeah. Another Bingo! cover, yeah. I'm praying, I'm praying, I'm praying. Don't, don't get too up. If it doesn't... Finish by this week. Then it's gonna be like next week after my the long break that I had. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. Oh, blah, blah, blah. People who are streaming, you gotta to check. Um, let's see, let's see. Today's one, twenty sixth. Okay. Okay, so Scarla is still having her debut two point stream. While we're at it, I'm gonna put her channel and now uh, you guys could check it out after stream uh, 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 let me let me pin okay chat 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 tomate chat tomate chat okay so that's pinned um sunny will be streaming at 5 5 a.m it says va ike will be streaming dishonored by at 6 a.m petra will be streaming stray at 7 p.m she's gonna meow meow Mowing. Uh, Nina and uh, I think this is Pomu will be streaming a Yakiniku date at 12 afternoon. Uh, and I will be on IPN's birthday at 1. Uh, Selena will be doing a stream at 4. Uh, Aster is gonna play Enter the Dungeon at 4. Uh, Miss Elira Pandora will be streaming uh, Xenoblade at 4 as well. Um, Nina is gonna play Great Game. Hmm? That's it. Binana will be on IPN's birthday at 5. Shu as well, 5 p.m. They're gonna play Valorant, the two of them. Um, Pomo will be streaming uh, Me MGR. What's MGR? Metal Gear Sorrid. <laughs> I don't know what MGR means. MGR <laughs> Blade Wolf DLC. Metal Gear ro Rolled? Uh, Rising, okay. <laughs> Metal Gear Rising, Revengeance, yeah, I'm sorry, I'm not familiar with any of the Metal Gear series. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Zach, thank you so much for joining the membership. Welcome. <laughs> um. <laughs> uh. Kyo will be streaming at 6. Alban will be streaming at 8. Uh, Dead of Night finish. 
Uh, Aya will be streaming at 8 p.m. as well, getting over it. Um, uh, Finana will be doing a membership stream at 8. Oh! And then me! I will be doing a membership at 10 p.m. So, um, our building was actually destroyed during the calamity. The members know about that. So, um, uh, I don't know what we're gonna do. <laughs> Not gonna lie. I think we're just gonna talk. We're just gonna talk how to rebuild our stuff, I guess. I have nothing prepared for you guys. Uh, the other one that I prepared last week is already like... I can't do it. I can't finish it. I I'll try though. I'll try, but... Uh, highly unlikely. Yeah, we're gonna do a Zatsudan and maybe... A Zatsudan and then maybe next week I could have more time to prepare it. So two... Two membership streams this week? This month? Spanish moment. Hola, Mili. Saludos desde Ecuador. Me diverto mucho viendo tu stream. Gracias por cierto. Saludami a vieja sabrosa. Ha, ha, ha. What does that mean? Thank you! Oh, uh, gracias! Super chat, Victor. Gracias. It means... Let me see. Greetings from Ecuador. Vien, viendo. Thank you for the stream. Por cierto, what's that? Saludami a vieja sabrosa. What does that mean? Vieja sabrosa? What does that mean? Say hi to the vieja sabrosa. She called you a delicious old lady? Really? He means Reimu? Oh! Oh! Oi! Hmm. Um, what's it? Okay. <laughs> um, and then, uh, I think, uh, Petra will be pl watching Space Jam with Elira and... Shu? And Pomo? And then, uh, Ren will be doing Metroid Dread. By the way, say hello to the sexy ghost, basically. Oh, yeah! Raymond and I, we've been, like, calling. Well, alongside with uh, Niji UK. Fun stuff! We've been calling offline. You miss Reimu? Uh, okay. I will let you guys... Rainbow. I will tell Reimu that you miss her. Hmm. So, yeah. That's it for Niji Sanji EN's schedule. Can you imagine if it's gonna be, like, a hundred livers <laughs> in the future? And I'm gonna say, like, the schedule every single day. Like, okay, guys. So here's the schedule of all of the hundred livers. <laughs> At 8 a.m., we have this, 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 this. And it, it's gonna be like a whole hour of me just like <laughs> telling all the schedules. <laughs> uh, so we gotta, you know, make a, make the most out of it until we, uh, until it's, until it gets an hour. For now, it's only like 10 minutes, which is good. But it's just gonna get bigger and bigger. So we, let's appreciate the small ta the times where it's still we, c we could still <coughs> we could still like read all of these <laughs> memorize all your cool highs. Oh yeah, we could talk about the the debut. Did you guys like uh, Iluna's debut? Not gonna lie, the song is so catchy. I kind of want to sing it. Ajime mashte. So catchy. I was. This is like one of the things I really like about debuts is that. We, um, we tend to like hang out together in a call. Uh. You like Ren's original? Oh, me too. Oh my god, I think Ren's like so good. Kind of crazy. <laughs> they all went ham. Like Maria is so cute. She's so cute. I I I hope she feels better. I hope I really hope she feels better. She's so cute. Oh my god. Maria's so talented. Yeah, I, I like Maria a lot. Blue Sugar was great. Yeah, I I really enjoy all of their debuts. Uh, let's see. Maria's singing is so cute. Uh, have you guys commented on her Kami Puina? That was a surprise, not gonna lie. Mar Maria's Kami Puina, like, yeah, after the, dis after the debut, after the stream, she like... Drop a banger song. I was like, oh my god. Let's go, Maria. She's really cute, yeah, yeah. Um, what else? Uh, who went next? Kyo? Kyo was fun. Kyo is really... I'm... Kyo is very charming, I guess. Oh, Kyo is super charming. He's, he's like... Natural at it. I was like super surprised. Like, whoa, he, this guy... You know, like, okay. The thing is, like, when Kyo debuted... Or at least when I debuted it, I was like so nervous. It's like, ah! 
Hello, hello everyone. Um, my name is Millie Parfait, and you know, you always get that because like you have a lot of people watching you. Back in the days, uh, we like when I debut, I think we have nine k people who are watching me, but like. Oh my god, 9k already for me is just kind of like, oh, Hazkashi, I'm so nervous, you know? And then, like, these guys are debuting with, like, so many people watching them, and I couldn't imagine how nervous they are. And so, but Kill was, like, natural. He, he was, like, super confident, and it was, like, really, really nice, actually. <laughs> it's like he wasn't nervous at all. He's like, oh yeah, uh, I could do this. Like, he, mm. um, um, uh, let's see, Aya. Aya was really fun as well. Aya was, uh, she, she speaks very elenco. I can't even speak the word elenco. El, el, elongated, eloquently. El, eloquently. You know what I'm trying to say? You know what I'm trying to say? El, elo, el, el, <laughs> eloquent, eloquently, <laughs> eloquently. <laughs> by the way. <laughs> yeah, yeah, she has a way of saying words. And then she said, like, she's a D and D, uh, dungeon DM. She's a DM, and I was like, whoa, is this the D and D arc for Niji E N? Let's go. Let's freaking go. Yeah, she has like really good uh taste. Hmm. Um I think it was her. The one who said like so we were in a call, like everyone was on the call, and uh, there's this one particular BL that was really old, and I think Raymo was like Raymo, there's another person who was like, Oh my god, I never it's been a while since I heard that BL. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so um uh, uh, what else? Aster? Holy shit! Aster! Oh my god! Like... Aster's debut is... Kinda cracked! Gravitation? Yeah, 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 that's right. I think... I think that was, uh... That was... Aster's debut was, like, full-on animation. Uh, the intro screen was great. Ending screen was great. Overlay... Mwah. So good! Uh, he's also like a League of Legends player, so that's really fun. <laughs> League of Legends? Is that a champion? Wait, what's the rank? He was showing his rank on League of Legends, but I don't know what rank. <laughs> I, for someone who played Aram religiously the on my whole life, I don't know what rank is that. Is that the highest rank? Challenger? What's a challenger? Is that higher than a diamond? I don't know. Is that higher? Tell me. Pretty insane. Uh, highest one? Oh, so he could go pro then. <laughs> What's that? Okay, okay, okay. So the lowest one is... Rock? Iron? There's a new one, right? I think it was rock. So uh, rock? Bronze? Silver? Platinum? Oh, iron! Oh! <laughs> My bad, my bad. <laughs> my bad. <laughs> sorry, 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 sorry. Okay, iron, <laughs> iron, bronze, uh, silver, platinum, diamond, and challenger. Is that correct? I feel like I missed something. Say aluminum, gold. Oh, gold. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, so iron, bronze. Iron, bronze, silver, gold, platinum, diamond, master, and grandmaster? Wait. For real? There's masters and grandmasters? Wait, for real, for real? Oh. Hi, Jesus. Sure. Yes? Oh. Yeah, get out, Bob. We're talking about League. <laughs> What's wrong with the... Uh... Um, what else? Then Challenger. Wait, 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 what? So, Grandmaster... Master, Grandmaster, and then Challenger? 
Yeah. What happened? There's so many now. But um, wait a minute. But isn't isn't iron more? Isn't bronze more important than iron at this point? Pred? No, pred is apex. No. Are you guys trolling me right now? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know anything about League of Legends. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, um, let's let's go back to the topic of uh, the debut. Uh, let's see. Scar Scarla. Oh, Scarla was um. Scarla was um. It was unfortunate that she was lagging the whole time. Um. I it's a, uh, it's but like, hmm. Scar Scarlet's debut was a little bit laggy, but I think she got the points across though. I don't know. I haven't watched the vod yet, but I think the vod should be fine, right? EGE and curse. Yeah, but she re she she did a, a follow up, which is you know such a good thing, and her internet was better, and she could have uh, portrayed more in the future. Portrayed more, I guess. So that's good. She did a re redemption debut. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, she's like, um, really, she's like a, a older sister type, right? I think so. We honestly think she's like a mommy. I feel like she's more of like an older sister, like a Onesan type of uh, character. But that's just me. I think mom, Nina is still like, uh, Nina is still like the mom of everyone. But, um, she's, uh, she looks like a, she, her voice is also super nice. Then we have Ren, which is probably a really good idea to put him at the end. <laughs> Gosh, Ren's debut is just—I don't know. I say Ren's debut is probably the most in an ideal world. It's flawless. No scuff. Overlay was perfect. Intro. I have no idea how. He, he made his own song in a span of, uh, you know, this, this long, which is pretty crack. <laughs> and it's a good song, too. <laughs> Fun fact, you know those songs that I did on my debut? I did all of those, too. <laughs> but it was so fucking ugly. <laughs> oh my god, I did. This is what happens, guys. Like, don't make... How many songs did it? Two songs. Don't make two songs if you're in a rush. Yeah. It's ugly. Yeah, my first song though. Da 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 da. Na na na. I I still I, I don't even remember the song. I I did everything in there. <laughs> and I and I use Google. I use Deep L. I, I, I use deep L to, <laughs> to make it Japanese. <laughs> deep L, of course. Yeah, deep L. Maybe that's why like the Japanese listeners were like, "What the fuck is she saying?" <laughs> Oh yeah, my original songs, they got... They, they disappeared from uh, everything. They're gone, so... They're listening to it every day. Aw, thanks guys. I appreciate it. But I'm not really proud of it. You wanna hear the English version? I, I lost all my files there. It's gone. <laughs> Maybe in the future, I'll sing the English song. Um, what else? Uh, yeah, all of them are great. I'm um, really looking forward. I hope you guys... I hope you guys give them a chance to, you know, um, give them the chance to uh, shine and uh, learn more about them in the future. That's one of my favorite songs. Ah, huh? thank you. Off collab soon? Nah, uh, yeah. They're probably very busy, but um, let's uh, let's, uh, give them your love and support. If you see them streaming, maybe drop by. Hey. But yeah, um, yeah, please support Luna and uh, uh fun, 
uh, there's gonna be a lot of fun things. I'm looking forward to interacting with them. I am so shy. I am very, very shy when it comes to like meeting new people, but I'm gonna do my best. I, uh, I'm really shy. <laughs> uh, and, um, this might be uh, a thing too, maybe. Um, scream out Etheria. <laughs> This, uh, this might be a little bit, um... Maybe it's just me. Maybe it's just me, but, um... Let's try to be respectful, I guess. Um... I see a lot of people are saying, like... Oh, yeah, um... She looks like... Rosamy, or, like, she looks like... This person. Maria looks like this person. And I think... Maybe... Maybe I'm speaking out for them. Maybe they don't mind about it, but... No one in the world... Wants to be compared to anyone. So, please try to refrain saying that because you know, e each liver has its own individuality. So, don't say something like, oh, yeah, um, what's their most ones? Are you know, like Maria is like Rosa me, but you know, clearly they're, they're not. No, or like, uh, oh, yeah, Kyo is like Kuchan, but younger because it's, um, that's not true. <laughs> like, Fuchan is Fuchan and Kyo is Kyo. And they're two different people. And you shouldn't be saying, like, just because they sound kind of like the same, you should be saying, like, they're similar. You know? So don't, don't try to compare because, like, maybe it sets up a sand, it sets up, it sets up some standards, you know, in, in them. And, like, just imagine, like, in your scenario, in a scenario where your mom compares you to, like, your sister or, your cousins when it comes to like achievements when clearly you, you know you have a lot of potential so yeah so please try to refrain saying things like that and uh i would be very happy if you like you know, watch them as an individual and not compare them to other people yeah hmm. and like it's really bad it's really bad to be compared you know you, i'm pretty sure you guys know the feeling right Yeah, sorry for being uh, preachy. Just, uh, I just wanna defend, I guess. <laughs> Not defend, defend, but like, maybe, like, noticing some, some people in the chat. But like, sometimes, you know, you kinda like, you kinda like get, get it, right? Like, you, I guess, in a way, like, people are like, whenever you see something that's similar, you, you tend to compare. Just, uh, just be very mindful. I'm pretty sure that they're still trying to find uh, their places. And um, being compared to someone is probably not good for their morale. Kinda. You know? <laughs> That's about it! Mm. Compare say so Millie to the unsay so Millie? <laughs> What's the difference? <laughs> I sound like Millie one. Well, technically, we're kind of the same. Mm. But yeah, just just be very careful. Um, I don't know what they feel about it, but it's just my observation. Mm. But maybe they don't mind. Actually, I don't know. <laughs> mm, but I... I, mm, I guess if I'm a Kohai, I'll be very happy if I get compared to Rosami sama you know? <laughs> Yeah, chat. When are you gonna compare me to Rosemi? I'm waiting. I'm Millie too now. See, I was so wholesome today. <laughs> Kinda. Say so Millie would have saved the baby. Never. Hold on. Oh no, I'm lagging again. Whenever I click settings on Discord, uh, not Discord, OBS. Always lags. I'm cuter than Rosemi. Um. You watch her streams or no? <laughs> Do you watch her streams at all? <laughs> uh, I really like Rosamie's um shorts. She did this like uh what was that? She did this thing um the old yeah old uh Rosamie. I love that so much. She's so freaking funny. I love Rosamie. I DM her. And I was like, yo, Rosalie, I miss you. Come back, please. And she's like, or like, I didn't even know she was on break. But I was like, <laughs> I was like,
like, Rosamie, you were gone? Where are you? And she was like, she sent this where she kind of like told me, she told me where she was. And I was like, send me souvenirs, okay? <laughs> I love, I love her. She'll be back on the 28th. Yeah. Hi. I miss Rosamie. We Rosamie and I have like a plan. In the future. Where? Um. Am I allowed to? Oh, yes, so I guess it's fine. I asked her to do a, a ASMR video together. It's a it's a video, not a stream. So basically, she's gonna be on the left side and I'll be on the right side, and it's gonna be both on our channels. So I think I think we will be doing like uh, two sets. Uh, 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 both are, both our channels. Fun, right? But yeah, we can do it right now. But in the future, sounds good. I know. I really want to do like a, a ASMR collab with someone, but like, it's really impossible to do one if it's not in real life because Discord is mono only. So Discord, I don't know if you're here, but maybe in the future, if you could make it like an option to become mono or stereo, that way we could do ASMR collabs. I could appreciate it, please. Thank you. Also, my OBS crashed again. I know that's so funny. OBS is like I have a 3080 now, and I'm still surprised that my OBS is still crashing. <sighs> OBS, please, please OBS. Oh, there you go. Nice. Um, what am I supposed to do? Oh yeah, I'm gonna turn into pink. <laughs> How's it growing? Wubba dubba dub, is that true? Oh god. <laughs> what do you mean? How do I become Rosamie? Hello, Millie. Oh, adi, adi. If you don't mind, what are your new PC specs? And do you have a gaming monitor to go with it? I think so. I have a gaming monitor. I think. Um, my specs are... Hello. Let me... I have a 3080 Ti for a GPU. A lot of people like that. Like knowing that. I have... Give me one sec. I'm lagging for some reason. It's on the membership. <laughs> it's on the membership. I, I posted it on my membership. Let me, give me one sec. Ah, uh, let's see, let's see. I have an AMD Ryzen 9 5900X um, And then uh, a RTX 3080 Ti uh, RAM is Corsair Vengeance RGB Pro 32GB I bought another hard drive Is this HDD? I don't know what you call that But I call it C drive and D drive Okay That's why I told my tech friend I was like Okay, tech friend, my old PC has C column and a D column. I don't know what you call them. And this one does not have does not have a D column. And the D column my D column is where I store my games. And I don't know if it's going to slow down my PC if I put it on the C column one. Hard disk drive, yeah, I don't know anything about PC. And so I ask I asked my tech friend to buy me the uh, a D a D column. HDD. Drive C and drive D. Oh, okay. I don't know anything about it. That's what he they they understand what I'm trying to say anyway, so um yeah. He got me another one and it's really fast apparently. I'm happy. The P in Millie Parfait means pink. Yo, I didn't know you could do this, but I miss you so much. Ah, oh, thank you, Aisu. Happy to see you back. Thank you. I'm glad to be here. I'm glad to be streaming. Um, what else? Buy me a D. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it. I need more space for my games. You know how it. Oh my god! Can I tell you guys one thing? Can I tell you the reason why my PC poofed? It's the query. 
Mm, it's the query. So I think query was like 40 gigabyte. After the query, is it query? Quarry? Qu quarry? After the query, I cannot, I cannot open my PC. Like it won't even, it will just crash after I start doing a stress test. Yeah. Quarry? Qu query? How do you say it? Curie? Probably the GPU. Yeah, I think so. Etheria! <laughs> oh, the, yeah, the query killed my PC. Query? Query? Uh-uh-uh. Oh. So, yeah, it's, it's, it's gone. All oh, my files are also, like, gone, too. Pronounce Kusi? What is that? Really? 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 Quarry. Ah, today was fun. I enjoyed. I enjoyed my my day today. You know, I I usually do like two streams per day, but I don't know if it's okay to say, but like today, <laughs> today <laughs> I woke up late. Um, I woke up, <laughs> which is today's oh God. Today's Monday, right? I mean, yesterday, a little bit yesterday's Monday. Um, if you guys don't know, I. I go do volunteers on Mondays. I go to the the hospital ward, the children's ward, and today I didn't go <laughs> because I quit. And waking up at two at two p.m. I woke up at two at uh, one. Oh, welcome! Thank you for joining the membership. I wake up at one, and I was like, "Whoa!" I feel so refreshed, and I just laze around. I laze. I read a book. I act for for the first time ever. I I relaxed, and now I was like, I like this. <laughs> I like this so much. I like it. I like relaxing. I like sleeping in at, like at the uh, 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 sleeping out until one p.m. on a Monday. That was really fun. I enjoyed that. Because usually, if I don't, if I don't really have any vol uh, volunteer work, I. I just uh I, I I stream early, which is 10, 10 a.m. Ten yeah, ten a.m. But uh I promised myself I'm only gonna stream one time per day. So that was really fun. <laughs> I enjoyed it so much. I'm so jealous! Do it on your off day! It's really fun. Um <clears throat> But yeah. I had so much fun today. I really enjoyed I was really refreshed, energized on the stream and it was really fun. Ah. <sighs> This was great, but it's 1 a.m. Good night, Roquetto. Have a good night. Glad to know. Yeah, I'm resting, guys. Woo. Um, what else? I think. Oh yeah, I played Final Fantasy VIII Futan. We did the dailies. Um, we unlocked um, because the the fucking guy does not wanna progress to the ARR main story quest. So I'm trying to find like new activities and stuff to play with him. Uh huh. And so, we went together on a new dungeon. It was called, um... Oh, uh, what is that thing called? Ah, what's it? Ah, it's a dungeon with a uh, wanderer, something like that. Something like, oh, wait, I, see, I think I still have it. Um, Wanderer's Palace. The one with a lot of tone berries. Okay, it's level 50. Uh, level 50 dungeon in uh, Wanderer's Palace. Yeah, from there's like a ton there. Yeah, 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 that one. So we were finding that, and then we're at the we're at the last boss, and there, there's there's this one person in our party who were like, "Are you guys from Niji Sanji En?" <laughs> and and Fuchan and I were like, "Whoa, we're f we're famous." <laughs> And um like <laughs> those that was really something that was fun. And so yeah, they recognized us and our and we were like uh so okay, okay. So in the beginning there was this uh I think there was a uh a, a party per a party one of the people that partied with us, right? Were like teaching us how to play the final boss. So they were like they were like oh 
Okay, when you fight the boss... Make sure you don't kill any of the Tonberries because it's gonna make it harder for us. Right? And so... They... They taught us how to do it and then they said, Are you guys from Niji Sanji EN? And I, I was like... Yes. And then I, I told Fu Chan like... Can I... Can I hit the Tonberries please? <laughs> and Fu Chan was like... No. They know we're from Niji EN. Don't you dare. <laughs> uh, yeah, after that, I, we just... um. After that, we, we left the party and say thank you for the, uh, the party. <laughs> I just want to see how it works! <laughs> yeah, I wanted to troll. Because that was my first time. That was my first time playing that dungeon. I never... I never unlocked that dungeon before because uh, I only play MSQ. Don't you dare tarnish our names, I know! <laughs> but yeah, after that, we, we left. We ended, uh, and uh, I did the stream. <laughs> I, wanna, I wanna level so bad! <sighs> I wanna play, I wanna play Final Fantasy! <sighs> oh shoot! No, I got a lot of tangents again. Well, yeah, yesterday was really fun. Hanging out with uh, everyone in Niji, Niji Sanji and was really fun during the debut. Oh yeah, you know, oh my god, can I just tell you like Mister asked me for a collab the other day, and I was like super duper happy. I was like, my my face is like grinning from side to side of my mouth, like like I'm like a joker, like. Mista invited me. I'm so proud of you, Mista. He's finally warming up. I'm so proud. Ugh, ugh. The hints were there. Yeah, I was like really proud of him. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy. Finally, another cola. I don't think I have a lot of solo collabs in my Niji Sanji stay. It's gonna be one year. I don't think I ever had a solo collab with Nina. Right? Is it? By the way, did my Moto-san answer you? No. I was red. Actually, let me see. Yep. It was red. Uh, Mar playing Mario Kart if you want to come in and pog me. That's Luca. Da -da 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 -da. But yeah, fun, fun. It's okay. I mean, he's busy. Um, Senpai is busy with uh, Niji Koshin. Princess collab with Nina, but that's a sponsorship though. I wanna like collab. Oh yeah, maybe. Uh, even Raymu. Have I ever had a solo collab with Raymu yet? Oh my god, Rainbow and I never had a cola with you. What the frick? We had this thing one time when I was doing uh, Duolingo Spanish, but that's about it. But he just she just came in the chat. It's so funny because like <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> How about Rosamie? Did I ever had a solo <gasps> Did I ever had a solo collab with Rosamie? I think Rosamie and I plan to plan to collab together, but well, it never happened. Oh my god! Oh my god! We gotta fix that, right? We gotta fix that, we got Okay, here are my goals. Short-term goals. We gotta make sure we have a collab with Nina. And, uh... Reimu. Solo collab with Nina and Reimu before one year. Okay? Once August starts... I want you guys to spam me like... Where the fuck is Reimu and Nina collab? Okay, every, every stream. <laughs> Wait, I sold a collab with Alira? When? Is Millie secretly an introvert? Yeah, um, it's not, not obvious. I'm really shy in like asking people. ASMR? Oh, yeah, 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 you're right. You're right. Oh my god, you guys are more. <laughs> you guys remember more than me. <laughs> but yeah, I, I get really shy and stuff, so. I get really, really shy. I just. 
Here's the thing. Here's the thing. Um, I'd like to. I, one of my motto in my life, besides it's not a bad day and not a li bad life, it's just a bad day and not a bad life, is your time is important. Time is important. I always say that to you guys every single time. It's like a broken record at this point. Like, I always thank you guys for, you know, taking your time to watch me and do this and stuff. But it's also apply like the same thing, I guess, with other livers, you know, they're also streamers, right? And so I get really shy whenever I ask for a collab because I feel like I'm taking their time, their precious time. Like, you know, they could have stream on their own channel, but they pick to stream with me. Like the undating game, that was already in my mind for the longest time, but I didn't execute it until recently because I, I was really shy. Uh, so, ugh. I just get really shy. I don't want to waste people's time. And sometimes, you know, what if that collab is a make or break to someone, right? What if afterwards they didn't have fun and uh, and it, it turned awkward to... I, I'm thinking... It's, it's so bad because I'm already thinking like negatively. Like, what if they didn't like me or like, what if... What if they... What if my, my jokes are not... They're kind of like jokes. Yeah, so so I think I think I'm gonna I'm trying to be more civil. That's why I'm Millie too right now. Trying to be more civil, trying to be as uh less degen as I am, that way I could match their their rhythm I guess and their jokes. Mm. Oh, yeah. Ugh. Someday I'm gonna have a lot of confidence and ask a lot of people. Oh yeah, a lot of my friends. Um, I think there's a new convention in the Philippines recently and a lot of my friends have been sending me photos of Millie Parfait and <laughs> I'm so happy. I also see it on my on my Twitter on my Twitter as well. You guys tag me. Thank you so much. And I'm like super duper happy. I am so happy. I see a lot of cosplayers. <sighs> I'm so happy. I'm so happy! I wanna see a Millie Parfait cosplayer and take a photo with them! <laughs> ah! Someday! One of these days, I'm just gonna fly to like... Uh, what's a popular convention in the Philippines? Cosmania maybe? Maybe not this year? Next year? I'm gonna be like, hello, can I take a photo of you? And then you're gonna just be like, yeah, sure! And then you didn't realize you actually took a photo of the real Millie Parfait. And the thing is like... I'm pretty sure you won't recognize me. You wouldn't, you wouldn't recognize me. Trust me, I know. <laughs> All the cosplays are pretty. I know. I'm so happy. Ah, I'm so happy. Oh, I just want to squish all the Millie Parfait cosplays. Oh my god, there's this one too with the the. Um, I think it was an A and one. And uh, there's two of them. <gasps> two of them in the sea of Luxium, and I was like so happy that I see them. Like, ah, it's so cute. And the other one is like. Totally my proportion, by the way, Big Booba Millie Parfait. And I was like so happy. I was like, yes! Thank you! Thank you for cosplaying me! The Big Booba Millie Parfait on AN 2022. Thank you for cosplaying me. Taskaru, Taskaru. Very accurate representation of Millie Parfait. Taskaru. <laughs> uh. Thank you! Uh. <laughs> the copium. <laughs> okay, okay, let's stop it here. I think that's a good way to end the stream. Think about that big Boba Millie Parfait. Actually, there's a lot of really good cosplayers on uh, on my... I'm gonna need to retweet them. Because like, they're all, all pretty. They're all so pretty. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you for cosplaying me. I'm so happy. <laughs> ah! Okay. That is it for my stream today. Thank you so much for watching. Apparently, Scarla already ended her stream. Wah. So, who are we gonna raid today? Uh, Maria. Is it called Maria or Maria? Chat. Oh my god, her voice is so cute. Oh my god. Maria. Maria jang kawaii. Kawaii, kawaii. 
Here's her link. Oh, 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 my YouTube fro Why is my YouTube freezing? I don't I don't get it. I don't get it. Why is it freezing? What are you guys doing? Are you guys spamming me? It's not even a spam. My chat's not even that fast. Compared to like my my Filipino stream. Have you ever have you ever been in my Filipino streams like ever? <laughs> I can't even look at my chat. Holy shit. I like I like this chat. It's so comfy. But like, oh my god, and no offense to you guys, I you guys are amazing, you guys are wonderful. But like, whenever I stream Filipino, it's just like, it's too fast, way too fast. So I tend to like, uh, my 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 brain is not even functioning that much. Whenever I look at my chat, sometimes, but but here I could I could still read your chat, so that's good. Too hype, oh, yeah. Um, I did this recent Filipino stream called um. MMK maala ala milikaya which is like if, uh, um, if there's like non-Filipino people here that are watching it's pretty much like um submissions of like letters but the letters were not really good letters <laughs> they're all like shit posts <laughs> um, and so like they they were really fast that was a really fast stream and life advice <laughs> useless li life advice yeah I want to do more of those in the future. That sounds. It was really fun to to do. But yeah, that was really, really fun, and that was really fast. And everyone's just like, ha 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 ing. And uh, I think there were multiple. There are times where my stream broke because of it. Like the chat literally froze for a good three seconds before it spam. That's how fast the <laughs> that stream is. And you know, a lot of people are saying like. Really, maybe you should do slow mode. And I'm like, no, slow modes are for weak people. <laughs> and uh, I think there, I had some bots that day too. I had some, a lot of bots, but uh, the bots were weak against a sw the swarm of the Filipinos. <laughs> the chat was too fast for the bot to be seen. <laughs> and that was really fun. Okay. Um. Yeah, I never do slow mode. I. My, 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 I could read sometimes. I know, like, thank you guys for watching. Um, please go ahead and watch Maria's stream, Mari Chang. I hope I could call her Mari Chan or Mari Mari. Mari Mari is really cute. And that's about it. I'll be seeing you guys tomorrow on my membership stream. If you're not a member, it's okay. I'll see you guys on Wednesday morning. Ah. And I gotta go pee. I've been holding it in. It's been four hours now. Okay, bye guys! Ultimately, thank you for watching! Bye bye! Time to eat, you guys! Also, bye. Bye, guys. You're gone. Oh, wait. I could see. You could still see. Bye, guys! Thank you for watching! I'll see you guys tomorrow! Bye!